but it will be full of treasure for the glory zone. I mean, for the meta zone. Not the glory hole, which is a thing in this game. Ah! My mouse to move it slightly. <laughs> Play that in real life? Absolutely. 100%. I wish I could do this in real life. Um, because I can do it in theory when on simple things, but like on my homework and studying, uh, you know, I do it the hard way. <laughs> my ADD just kicks in and it's like, you're going to do this one thing perfectly. Mother of, I don't know, who would be a Viking way of insult? You, uh... Yeah, you, you, you coward. Okay. It's, it's you scourge so the bottom of my boots. Oop, I, I, I'm gonna kill myself. Am I careful? Because I keep running around and you have to swim sometimes, and then I'm just gonna randomly drown one day and not know why I'm dead. Oh, <gasps> I picked up that wood and it floated into the sky. You, you son of a. Oh, it came down. Okay, thank you. So, like a poor deer being ran out into the waters. Did you hear that? Let's see. Okay, well. It's pretty heartless. I mean, I'm not really terribly vegan. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, Mark. Excuse me. I don't know. Yeah, actually. I'm gonna... Maha's gonna look and be like, be happy you have hands. Oh, God. <laughs> at, 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 that, at that even, Wilbur's like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Maha's literally just thinking of Eric and like how sorry he oh feels. Oh my gosh. <laughs> but yes. Yeah. I'm like unintentional intimidation. <laughs> extreme intimidation. <laughs> you see, he just kind of holds an eye for a second. I won't, I won't me hands and don't. Um, <laughs> he, he just starts to walk away. He, he literally just walks in between the both of you. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. And he just goes. <laughs> Walking down, just like if I if I see you again, I'll kill you. You hear me? I am the danger. I am the danger. You're. I'm not trapped in here with you. It's so different with me. You skeletons. I'd be like, I wish I didn't wake up. Yeah. Yes. I wish I'd stayed dead. I wish. I wish I was really dead. 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 Wait, wait. I'm taking care of uh, uh, the editor elves. I... Welcome, everyone, to another thrilling edition of Legion, but with a twist. This week, I'm taking over as GM. Daniel's going to be a player, and we're going to be doing something a little different. Similar to the last time I GM'd, um, we're going to be doing a little one shot adventure with a completely new cast of, of characters. So how about we just first start off by introducing these new characters. Daniel, who are you tonight? Well, I'll be playing Elizabeth Teardrop, Water Genasi, Pirate, and Dread Captain, Blue Skins, Eye Patch, and a shit-eating grin. It's a pleasure. Fantastic. Harley, how about you? Who are you tonight? I'm gonna be Big Boy Keeper of Secrets! I'm a wonderful wizard. And and what's your race? I'm a tabaxi, can't you see? As I stroke Ooh. my f my luxurious fur ch chin fur. <laughs> chin ah, fur. luxurious chin fur. Our friend Grim, who are you tonight? I will be Sneaky Help. No, plenty. I messed it up already. Sneaky Raven, the King Who Rogue. <laughs> <laughs> I have two names from that's why I messed it up. And the fantastic producer, M, who are you tonight? I'm starting off with a most common person, Stephen, <laughs> who is an NPC. and The he, average everyman. He, he has the 12 HP. <laughs> 
Oh, I'm sure he's going to make it through all the way to the end. <laughs> he's going to do great. Welcome, <laughs> fabulous. So, M, I leave you the uh, announcements and other things that you might want to share. Sure. So, hey, everyone. Welcome to Frankly, I Don't Give a Forks channel. Uh, we do have some ground rules to go over. There is to be no hate speech. Uh, we are welcoming to all walks, creeds, walks of life, creed, religion, gender, Bluetti, whatever. Um, anything said in our chats, we will be monitoring and we will be keeping it safe for our community. Uh, so just keep that in mind. Best ways to support us is to join our Discord server. It is free to you and it helps get you involved in the community. We have movie nights, we have game nights, we have raffles. Our current raffle that we have going on, uh, it is uh, da, 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 giveaway. Um, it is for the P One Piece Pirate Warriors 3, and it will be ending at the end of the month. We have some people that have already participated in it. All you have to do is go there, join our Discord, and press the little ta-da emoji icon, and you are entered. Uh, so some other things that are going on to help support us, join our Patreon, where you can get digital or physical merchandise, uh, and you can help support us. The last way to help support us is our Ko-fi account, uh, where you can donate all of your donations, go straight to making this possible. Um, and lastly, lastly, sorry, uh, be sure to go to our About Us page, and if you scroll down, you will notice that there is a free Prime subscription icon. Just click on that. It'll bring you to Prime Gaming, and you can link your Twitch to Amazon Prime, and Bezos will pay us on a monthly basis. So as he should. <laughs> as Give he us should. that Bezos bucks. Yes. So uh that is everything that's going on with us. Thanks so much. Fantastic. So tonight we will be playing Dungeons and Dragons using the fantastic early access game called Tailspire, like we did in our last one shot. And how about we get started? Whee! Let me set the scene for all of you. There have been rumors going around the city that the haunted old abandoned library has placed a curse on certain individuals. You see, it wasn't too long ago that this library, library was active People could come in, they could, they were loaned out books, and they were supposed to return them. But a lot of people never returned their books. And after a piece of the roof caved in, killing the librarian and the assistant librarian as well, the library was abandoned. And those books were still out there. Well, some of those people holding on to those books have been dying. So the king of the kingdom has called on you, a group of mercenaries that he, he does trust to get the job done. You see, he, as a child, came to this library and borrowed a book. He never returned that book. So now he fears for his life. Your mission? Here is the book, and he hand, hands it to one of you. Please return this in my name, so that you may break the curse that may be upon me. Out of curiosity, what is yes. the book name? Yes, ma'am. What did this child check out? <laughs> Human anatomy. <laughs> Yeah, for Steven, some of those pages might be sticky. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you all make your way down to the old aband abandoned library, and the doors open just for you. As you make your way through the doors, they shut. Oh, fucking great. So, players, it's all yours. 
Would you Time to return the book. Would you mind setting the scene of what we see? So, when you first entered the library, it was dark. You could barely see anything. The second those doors close, each little torch, lamp, all sources of light that are within this library suddenly come to life. Ooh. So right now, you see behind you is the door that you entered. And to your left, right in front of you, is a desk and a few bookshelves with a with a little ca candle flickering. To your right, you see um, what appear to be flipped over tables, some pages of books, rocks that have fallen from, from the ceiling that has caved in in that area a little. And you see a broken arch as well. There's a red carpet leading the way forward. And a few other bookshelves and pages just thrown about. <laughs> Tia will just kind of pass her hand on her eye patch. So, we're hunting evil librarians. Or we're just returning the book. I'm going to be honest with you, I've never been inside of a fucking library, so I'm not even sure where we put it. Can we just, like, drop it on the floor? Uh, who did you hand the book to, out of curiosity? I'm gonna say the king handed it to the wizen old wizard cat man. He looked smart. He looked like the book type. I keep the secrets! Well, drop big, big, big the drop the secrets on the floor, and let's get out of here. Oh! I keep the secrets! To bring the dust, no, yes? No, 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 that's that's what the fuck we got brought in here for. You gotta go, big boy. This is like when we play fetch. You gotta you gotta put it down so we can continue with the with the thing. I will only, I will only give secrets to who owns them. They kind of look around. I think. I don't think there's Let's anyone here. Let's just put here. secrets on the ground for anyone to pick them up. Yeah. On the desk? For, well, fuck it. Let's go and check out the desk then. Let's I'd be, like be. to look for a specific place for... Uh, well, you do see that her. desk right, right in front of you. That would be like the receptionist's desk if this place were still in use. Okay, then I'll walk up to it and I want to look. And see if there's like a sign in sheet. Because there's always. When a you, when you walk up to it, <laughs> there is a piece of paper that says, "All late returns must be made to the back office." Attentively, the librarian. I want everyone that has gone to this desk to roll me a uh, perception check. Oh, yeah. Give me some of that. Ah, uh, yes. The, cur the curse of the of the DM, bright and early. Fuck me. It's a... Uh... How, how well do you perceive wearing that, that eye patch? <laughs> uh, I, 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 oh. It doesn't mean... Yeah, I, I oh. have a very good eyesight in the one good eye I've got. Oh, I've, I've got 14. I, I can't see much. It's kind of dark. I rolled 14 too. I have both eyes. Anyone so, that rolled that rolled higher than the 13, you start to notice some something that looks like transparent near one of those bookcases there behind the behind the desk. It it's almost like something shimmering, moving around. Suddenly, all of you start to see it as it becomes brighter and brighter. And, and you see that? her. Oh. When, you, when you say that, she turns around and she goes, That was an effectively loud shush. Hey, miss. 
<laughs> we got book where you want us where Wait, we give book to you? I have a question. You're a Kenku. You can speak? I I I so a character in character. Uh out of character. Super curious. Um, <laughs> this is a, a weird weird moment to bring this up in the middle of an adventure. You can talk? <laughs> This whole time? I talk like a ten-year-old kid, like us, the ten-year-old kids I hung out with as a young one. Ah. <laughs> like, it's like, Miss, did he give book to you? Yes. Make you happy? Silence. In the library. Uh, must return book. Parents get angry if not. Hey. Be quiet, bird! It's whisper time now! I whisper. I, I whisper I, when I want to. Don't know if he's got an Do you have a piece of paper and and something to write with? Are, are you asking the ghost? Oh, big boy. Oh, no, big boy. I need a piece of paper. Maybe some charcoal to write something. Yeah. I do. I have those things. Yeah. She'll snatch it up and she'll be like. She just write book in very ugly lettering. She does not write well. I just kind of do like a little question mark. She taps on that note that I mentioned that says, "All late returns must be made to the back office." Attentively, the librarian. Are, are you the librarian? Are you the librarian? She smiles, and she oh, fades good. away. <laughs> fucking ghost. I fucking hate ghosts. I look at your handwriting and frown, and I grab the paper from you and write it in much better handwriting, and then hand it back. Fucking show off. And she just goes and she folds it up and she puts it in her pocket. <laughs> I'm helping. Very good at I'm... helping, little ones say. <laughs> um, so, someone roll me another perception check. Boy. I'll do it. Yeah, let okay. Big Boy do it. I'm sure Big Boy is amazing at perceptions. <laughs> oh, what yeah, do you I perceive, am. my boy? <laughs> Big Boy, my boy. Large lad. 21. Oh, shit. Yeah, 21? Well, <laughs> you see you. everything forever. <laughs> my monocle you... is really, my monocle is really good. Well, you're not using your monocle this time. You're not using your peepers either. You hear some rummaging coming from the right, the east area, east corner of this of this library. You, I, I, I go to you, it. When you look in that direction, you you do see some flipped over desks, some papers thrown about, a few books, and some bookshelves. And one of those bookshelves seems to be like moving back and forth. Uh, I'm gonna walk up to it and investigate. In my, in when my head. You, do that, you you see what appears to be a man hunched hunched over, like he's looking for something. I just kind of lean and, over to the group. Big boy knows the way. Oh well, let's fucking follow Big Boy then. Fuck. Okay. Uh, can I? Can I look over this guy's shoulder, like, all stealthy-like? You're gonna have to roll stealth if you want to be all stealthy-like. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Here we come, not being <laughs> stealthy at all. Sorry, big boy! <laughs> I'm on As you're walking forward, you see that there's cracks on the floor, and there's, like, roots just growing out of the floorboards. Oh, not big readers in this area. Trying to be sneaky as well. And now that you guys are all a little closer, you can see him. He's like reaching for something behind that that bookcase, and, and you hear him. Ah, my my book, my book. Ah. Do you want me to take this one? Uh, I'm not going to kill him. I promise. See. Yeah. Feathery helper help? You just hear Steven laugh at that. <laughs> no promise, promise. 
DM, I would like to, if the, if the people, I'd like to sneak up a little bit and let's see, just, does he have any weaponry on him? Or is he just kind of huddled up? Um, before you do that, big boy, you, you said you were going Ooh. to sneak up on him. Yes. What did great. you roll? I rolled a, I got distracted, sorry, I got a recount. <laughs> Fourteen. Fourteen? Okay. Yes. He seems to be pretty distracted, and as you get closer, he doesn't seem to notice you. He's very focused on whatever he's trying to reach for. Can I can I see what he's trying to reach for? It's behind, Whatever it is, it's behind that bookcase, and from where you're standing, you can't see it. You see what? the bookcase, you can't just see behind it. I, um, I... You haven't moved your token, so I don't know how close you are. Uh, I want to say pretty close. Move your token. Like right up so... in his business, trying to see what he's doing. Like I said, you just see him. He's reaching back there. It's like, rah, my rock, my rock. I'm going try and get him his book. I guess I'll... I'll, like, try and help him by opening the, the, like, moving the bookcase. Can I? Can I move you the bookcase? You can try. Yeah. It's a bookcase. Okay, so do I, uh, I'll roll for it. But what do I roll for? When you get up to the bookcase to move it, he notices you. And he sees you. And he just lets out a huge screech. <laughs> Time to roll for initiative, friends. Oh, fucking shit. All right. Oh, fucking you shit. see, this, this is the All fucking right. reason why oh, I don't go to libraries. This, this, this... Shit like this happens at the goddamn time. That's, That's better. That's an 18 it. initiative. 22. Oh, fuck. All right. Come on, plus zero. Oh, uh, yeah. I have four. Me too! <laughs> <laughs> I guarantee you beat my dexterity. Uh, Harley, what was yours? I got a four. And so was Steven? Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, I'm... I'm not even going to bother checking. I'm sure that Steven has a lower dex, so... Well, that's rude. But am I wrong? No. Am I wrong? No. <laughs> Steven's just, he's big and hard, just not a stat. Okay, so. The order will be. And let me turn on the turn base mode. It's going to be. Sneaky Helper Man, Sneaky Raven. Raven Helper, huh. whatever his name was, yes. followed by Teardrop, happens. then Big Boy, Steven, and lastly, the Ghoul. Oh, Top of the order, my friends. Ah, yeah. I guess. Sneaky Raven, it's your turn. Well, it probably helps if I... How far away are they from me? Let's find out. So you're here. You're Ooh. there. Eight point... Eight tiles, let's just say. If that's the case... I will... So, about 40 feet. Go up 20 mm -hmm. feet. No, 25. I'll go up 30 feet and throw a dagger at him. You want me to move him? Yes. A 19 to throw the dagger? Oh, you hit him. And then... Uh, you placed him on top of some roots. Let me oh, move him. My bad. Eight there we go. And... Would you, would you allow sneak attacks since big, big boy's next to them? Yeah, he's probably pretty focused on big boy at this moment. 
I'll allow it. Then 10 damage to sneak attack, so 18 damage in all pair sneak attack. 18 total? Alright, yes. give me one second. All right, you got him. Is that the end of your turn? And then I will bonus action if there's a place nearby, hide. There's a uh, plenty of tables that are flipped over you could hide behind. I duck behind a table. Only rolled okay. 17. You only rolled 17? Yes. I have, I have plus 11 to stow. That's my main Jeez. Gift. I'm a sneaky boy. Alright, you sneak. You're behind that table. Oh, Is that the end now? Yep. Alright, teardrop. Your go. Alright, so... Mr. Green and Ugly over there, he hasn't attacked the big boy yet, right? Not yet. Well, he's made it pretty fucking clear that he's about ready. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, I'm gonna go in. I see that, uh... My little bird friend made it over here to the books. So I'm actually going to take my action and she's just gonna, as she's walking, she's gonna smack Steven on the ass. It's been a long time, hasn't it? Ah, oh, and oh, she's oh. gonna go and keep on walking <laughs> and she'll, she'll, move a full, she'll move a full 30 feet. And as she's walking, I want her to Kind of just look at the ghoul. It's like, oh fuck it. I mean, it's been a while. She's gonna just unhinge, uh, unclip her pistol, the caretaker, and then she's walking with it. I want her to kind of like catch the torchlight by the by the ghoul a little bit, because you know she's blind to one eye. So to okay. just kind of fuck, to kind of fuck around, she'll just kind of do the whole, all right, all right, kind of point, and she'll just whistle, hey, you, green and ugly. Ah. Woo! 19 plus stuff. Give me a second. <laughs> plus, plus stuff. Five. Plus stuff. Well, you hit it with 19 plus stuff. 19 plus stuff. <laughs> Forgive me, guys. I haven't been a player in in in, in, a, in a minute. Well, I, I I get to be, but you know. <gasps> That's a 12 plus three. That's a 15. Now, question. Wait, no, I didn't want to sneak attack him. I'm I'm not gonna bullshit it. So she just bah, she'll go and she'll take the shot out. And she goes, she looks, looks to him. Did you find what you were looking for? Yo, fuck. And she just, she I just, wait. See if he goes and he jumps up again. Oh, uh, he's not, he's not looking too great. Took that right in the mouth. Is, oh. uh, is that the end of your turn, Teardrop? She's gonna, she's just gonna wait it out now. She wants to go and see I... what, uh, what, what he does. It's Big Boy's turn. Big boy. Uh, big boy, big boy would like to cast Cantrip Sword Burst, which uh, creates a momentary circle of spectral blades that sweep around me. You All see that blades within... just appear around you. Cool. Uh, all other creatures within five feet of me must make a success on dexterity saving throw or take 1d6 force damage. Well, he is not within five feet of you. Gotta get oh, he's not? Gotta get I thought that... You, you okay. can walk up. Get... You haven't used can your move action. Can I get closer action. and then do that? Yes. Please? So what was the uh, save that, that he needs to make? Um... 14. All right. Constitution, right? Mm, dexterity. Is that what you said? Dexterity? Dexterity. Okay. I love the spell so much. I rolled a 19. Oh. He saves. Shoot! He just limbos away from those swords. From those Ooh. blades. Ooh, he's, he's a, a he's flexible. A, he's a spry little thing, isn't he? think I All have. Right. Oh, just so you know, action. Shadow Blade is a bonus action. Yeah, I was just gonna say, I think I have a Shadow Blade bonus action, so can I do that again? You, you can do that. Try it again. Wait, again? No. Oh, Shadow Blade. That's a bonus it's action. A bonus you can do action. a different spell as a... 
Yeah, you can do a different spell. Okay. You can do a regular uh, one. The regular one. <laughs> regular. Regular. Or you spell. can just bonk them, bonk them with your big stick. I'm noticing a, a a theme with all of your characters, Harley. They all have bonking sticks. Bonk, bonk. I like a good bonking stick. Yes, I'm going to bonk him with my bonking stick. And since the tip, since the the top of it is like the skull of a of a bird that I have previously hunted. You got to uh, peck him on the head I'm with it. Peck him with the head with it, like a full on like jab. Yes. Okay. Roll to see if you hit him. Cool, cool. Um. What do I roll for? Just to hit is 14. You, yeah, just just to hit is 14. Yep, you hit him. Okay, cool. So now I... Now um, you roll that damage. Roll for damage. 15. <clears throat> Even 15. Not Damn. too bad. 50%. That's pretty good. So when you swing up your bonking stick, pecks right through his skull and he's dead. You guys kill. I am a master hunter! You see, like, I Steven whisper. just kind of, like, like, When you shopping. yell out like that. I oh. whispered! I whispered! I only speak in whispers. That was a very loud it's whisper. It's a loud whisper, but it was still a whisper. I fall my head up from behind Okay. The Fine. It was a whisper. <laughs> it was a loud whisper. Mm hmm but it was Super. a whisper. If Teardrop oh, sees Steven like, dust, like dusting off his, his arms. Oh yes, Steven, as always, the immaculate fighter. It's it's always good <laughs> to go and have you here with us. I, you see him take a I, bow? Oh, you know I've got your back. I feel safer with you here. I really, really do. <laughs> so um, as, as you guys are talking, I'm still hiding. You, you see the, the ghost appear again. Oh, shit. And she says, Silence in the library. Shh. And with that shush, you see magic come out of her ha of her mouth. Those blades that were around Big Boy, mm -hmm. they're gone now. Mm. Silence has been casted on the group. <gasps> You just see, like, Stephen maniacally laughing, but no noise coming out. <laughs> I would like to investigate behind the bookcase to see what that ghoul guy was trying to get. Okay. Might have been something... So, you, you see a book back there. Can I reach it? Yeah. I'll grab it. You grab it. Do we see Big Boy uh, like pushing, like, scrapping up litter like a cat, trying to find out whatever they're trying to find? Yeah, you do. <laughs> she goes to go with him, but she forgot that she can't. Like... <laughs> Nothing. When you pull out the book, you read the cover, and it says a collection of fairy tales, volume one. Okay. Uh, I'll put it on the shelf. Okay. You do that. After a while, you see that silence has been removed. Oh, fuck. How long after Big Boy puts it on the shelf? It was, it, it was only for like a minute. Ah. Uh. Didn't last very long. Maybe that was just a warning. Pop my head up and look at Tear, was it? Elizabeth. To my, uh, tear Elizabeth. to my friends, but you can call me Miss Elizabeth, yes. Feel free. Like... <laughs> hey, Miss. What was what was that? I make the... And then I mimic the sound of the gunshot. Oh, this. Oh, this is the caretaker. Um, Would you, uh, if it's okay with you, I'd like to do some slide of hand to go and do maybe like a little bit of a hand trick in front of the Kenku because she's ridiculous like that. Okay. Fifteen plus seven. I attempt to perceive this. That's a twenty-three. So she kind of does a hold. She kind of swirls a little bit, pulses it, unholses it, 
hands it to you, takes it back. Butch. Actually, as you hand it to me, I do another, I do a hand trick of my own and kind of trill it around my back and then tr present it to you. Um, you need to roll a sleight of hand if you intend I'll to do that. that. At least. I rolled a 16. Tyr will actually let the uh, let the raven take it. Okay. Look at you, you're fast, aren't you? You little bass. How does the Good feathers luck. get in between? Like, how does the feathers do that? I don't Steven, understand the mechanics of the creature. As as you're saying that, you hear something right behind you crawl up. I turn around and look. Ow! <gasps> Cat! I bend over to pet the greet the cat. Let it sniff my me immediate, first. My immediate response. When you bend over to pet it, suddenly the cat starts to change. And that cat starts looking a lot uglier. Damn it, DM. Why do you pull on players' heartstrings? Um, so unfortunately, I don't have like a tiger asset I can use. So uh, just imagine oh, no. this hyena looks like a big, big cat. I'd like if, to uh, if, excuse if, your imagination. I'd like to start off and be like, "Oh, what a cute big kitty!" <laughs> when when that happens, can I can I um, as as Raven's kind of messing around with the gun, she's just gonna go and like put her hand on the Raven's head, take the gun from him, and say, "Okay, that's enough. Show and tell's over." <laughs> so then she's, uh, she's like, save it. Watch out. Watch out, save it. Oh, wait, no, do I even see the cat? Forgive me, I'm, I'm metagaming. Do we see the cat? Um, you're, you're, both your backs are turned because you have, you guys haven't moved your, your characters around. I will say that the bird is here. Tear doesn't say um, shit. Big she doesn't boy the is by the shelf. Oh, oh you're, you're so good with that fucking gun. It's so great. Okay, hand it Steven, back and shoot me. I give it you back. had your hand extended. <laughs> oh, yeah, like you were going to pet the kitty. Oh no. It slowly places its mouth right on your hand. And it's about to as it's about to bite down. It disappears. I wanna let out the most girlish scream possible. <laughs> Please do. <laughs> I do a surprise call sound. We are, I'll turn around and just like save him. Chase him. My feathers. Yeah, yeah. I love, Whoa. I love a cord. Silence in the fucking library. Well, God. you silence. Hey, Mister. Big boy, just kind of I, like. I whisper. Hey, Mister. Last time you spoke loudly, the the scary lady made us all to um not talk. Well, maybe Stephen needs to be quiet because he talks too goddamn much. Stephen, what are you yelling at besides from your own shadow? I go over to see what Stephen was yelling at. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing. Nothing. You guys don't see anything. You just see Stephen there, standing, okay. shaking. Enough of the shenanigans. Come on, let's go and get our shit and let's go and bring this fucking book to the fucking back <laughs> office so I can get the hell out of this place. Go get my dagger. Draw my Big boy starts heading towards the back office. Over the back. Okay. Where is the back? Um, I assume it's in the back. Yeah. <laughs> Logic. Oh, 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 you fuckers got jokes, okay? Um, and right now she she'll actually she wants. I, to I see, see that that you so are. Cool. Teardrop is reacting to the voice of God. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm getting old. So I'm gonna go to your voices. <laughs> through this door. Oh my god, I lost, okay. I lost the sneaky what? raven. Where's the sneaky raven? You, I'm by the table. You open the, the oh, door, nice. here's the sneaky raven. Wait, which fucking door are you at? Sneaky raven, where are you going? To the door, behind the cat. Sneaky raven sneaks Thanks. behind the cat. Oh, what, um, big boy. Can, does big boy perceive the cat behind him? I'm not a cat. I mean, big big boy perceives the cat bird behind him. Does big cat boy bird. perceive the bird behind him? I'd like to think yes. so, but oh. big boy does not like that. I was trying to be sneaky. Big boy is gonna make sure, like, get out of the way and have the bird go in front of him. Big boy doesn't trust birds. Stephen oh, just dear. walks right by, completely He's clueless. Stephen. Wow, Stephen <laughs> is brave. <laughs> 
I just walked straight All right, into Steven. the room. <laughs> Steven, you notice there's someone in this room. Oh, I do? Aside from a corner of the room and the piece of a wall of the room missing, a tree that was growing outside seems to have broken through. There's some other, like, roots growing out of the wall. You see someone sweeping, but they're just kind of sweeping the same spot over and over again. I, 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 just sweeping. I want to turn to the group. I, I specifically turn to Elizabeth and point to the guy. It's like, when you put me on Dooley, I bet he knows where the librarian is. She's tears outside of the room. Does she hear her? I mean, does she hear? Um... You you saw everyone walk into the room. Well, Big Boy hasn't walked in. That's the thing. Like she was walking up to it, but uh, if she only goes and catches some of Big it, she's gonna say out. Steven, go and talk to the wildlife. It's fine. Don't worry about oh, it. You'll oh, be fine. Okay, okay. I walk right up. Elizabeth told me to do this. <laughs> You let's fucking with you. <laughs> you stand on the pile that it was. Oh shit! It was sweeping I, over. Shit. I, I don't know if you noticed that. I did so not. And and it so stops sorry. sweeping, and it looks at you. I look down. You know this that it looks like a zombie. I look down and I want to be like, oh, sorry. I want to take the broom from him and like sweep it back up for him and hand it back to him. He <laughs> he puts. He puts the room, like, on the side, leaning against one of the boxes. And I he see. lunges at you. Okay. I, I wanted to step out of his pile. But lunge away. <laughs> I, so, I rolled a five. Hey! I, you rolled acrobatics, so I have to roll athletics, right? Or is it vice versa? For grappling. Um... I, I rolled. Up. I rolled athletics. You roll acrobatics okay. to get out of the way. I always get it mixed up. I, Come I, on. I think I'm right. I'm the GM. Fuck it. I'm right. I sit because I say I'm right. Uh, that's a fifteen <laughs> plus a zero. Yeah, you you manage to get out of the way. Uh, he's he's kind of slow. I kind of just, just like I just like uh, oh oh. Excuse me. You know where the librarian is. He, he looks like he he wants to go for you. Um, I turn back. I guess we're in combat again, so. <laughs> I, I would like to do a let's, talk. Let's action. roll those initiatives again. I'd like to turn around, like put my head over the shoulder, and look at Teardrop. Yeah, you can do a talk. Te Teardrop. You, I should I should know not to this, listen to this you. This disengage the wildlife because I rolled the one to initiative, and I only get a plus four to it, so I've got a five. Get the fuck away from it. Seventeen. That is a seven. Because <laughs> uh, I get a plus zero to initiative. Harley, what'd you get? I haven't rolled yet. Oh. Got a oh. Four. Hey. Plus two is plus two is six. Hey, I'm so happy. I didn't do the worst this time. I did. Elizabeth. Oh, you did. I did. The road In my defense, I am an old man. What are you, Dex? Where's Big Boy? I don't see him. Uh, oh, there he is. He was behind the, the door. Yeah. He's up against I got the wall. Him. I got him. All right, the order is the bird. <laughs> the bird. Bird is the word. Bird, 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 bird. Um, the Zambino. Uh, you don't have the Zambino on the on what? On the scroll order. I I haven't updated yet. Oh, I'm updating it. Oh, my bad. Be patient. I'm sorry. Be patient. I'm sorry. All right, so I got the bird. I got the Zambino. Um, the average human man. Average human man. Average human man. The uh, human guy, cat human person. Thing. And then 
Teardrop. <laughs> oh, look at that zombie token right there. That's a... Uh... <laughs> look how All happy right. he is. He's very excited to have met you, Stephen. He probably has not had a... He probably has not had a good meal in the royal, and the fact that your head is as empty as a sack of rocks. I crazy. don't want to take him <laughs> on a date. We're not going out to dinner. You can do that, though. Oh, oh. I guess. Oh, oh my. Okay. <laughs> Did he say the zombie? Has the zombie noticed me where I am currently, or can I tell? The him? zombie's full attention is at the person who rudely messed their sweeping. My bad, guys. Gotta shoot my bow. It's a 14 hit. Let's yeah, see. 14 does hit. Out of curiosity, you're standing. Eight. And then. How are you shooting him? Right through me? Right through him, huh? <laughs> no, I... ah! He'll be fine. He got me sidestepped that. I wasn't thinking of that part. <laughs> Yeah, you got your move action. Please I'll move! Up to the left. You'll be fine. I mean, you dodge the zombie, you can dodge an arrow. There. Um, I rolled 14 all in all for damage. You shoot that arrow. Steven, you feel it graze your ear as it zooms by and just hits the zombie right in the head. That's a pucker factor Falls of down. like 10. <laughs> <laughs> the, the zombie is dead. Oh. Good, oh. good combat, everyone. You see Steven turn around, kind of like pop up his collar. <laughs> you did it Yo, again. I physically. <laughs> wait, if Steven hasn't noticed me yet, I'm gonna sneak up to him. I already him. said I turned around and popped up my collar. You, you know, I you, casually walk, walk up to you, and right as I get close. I just look, like, kind of angle myself at your ear, and just do a lion's roar. Is the is the zombie's room just on the floor? No, I do. A, no, I, it's up against that box that's in the oh, corner. Okay. Might be a little hard to see, but but it's there. Yeah, I, so, I, it. I was gonna prop it up out of respect, but it's already propped up. So. <laughs> Rest in peace, zombie. Here is your room. <laughs> I do a so, out of, so out of Same curiosity. Thing. I, I, Did I see I, anything in this room? I, Sorry. What was that? I, I, do, I do have a little bit of, out of, out of curiosity. Mm. So we're just killing the janitory staff and the co-workers. Most likely the little goblin man outside was just putting the books away and Steven just got the sweeper killed. You just see me kind of like, no one's safe around me. You get some experience for that, Stephen. Good job. We are, we, are, we are terrible, terrible people. We are terrible, terrible. What the fuck was he sweeping up, anyways? Oh, I, I, I turn back around and look, inspect the pile. It's rocks. Rocks. <laughs> you know what? Uh, you notice that there's rocks all over here. Like pieces of the of the wall have have fallen. Some chunk, chunks from the ceiling. There's like a whole area of the wall completely missing. Big boy, you want to do a thing? You would, you would. I'm just looking for secrets. Do I see any secrets in this room? Any potential secrets? I, I, I guess do a perception check. What? I would like to aid. I have nothing in the sense of aiding, but I'd like to <laughs> aid Big Boy. <laughs> sure, Big Boy, you get. You get advantage from a normal human person <laughs> aiding would, you. I would like to. How I'm I aiding is like... I rolled an 18, would, which is pretty perceptive, I'm, I would think. I'm pointing everything obvious out to you. <laughs> you don't notice any secrets in the room, except that maybe Steven has the hots for, for, for um, Elizabeth, but... Oh. That doesn't seem to be too secretive, how did considering you know? how they were talking earlier. How did you know? Big boy will keep that secret. <laughs> you are the keeper of secrets, big boy. <laughs> <laughs> big boy, so, big boy turns and goes shh and winks. I am super confused by this because I think like I haven't said a thing, and I think it's just you telling me to be quiet again. <laughs> 
Come on, the sexual right. tension is palpable. <laughs> Sneaky Reaper oh. like to do his separate investigation. Sneaky Raven would like to what? Do a separate investigation of his own, not trusting the cat, since he, the cat made him go in first. Okay, roll. Roll the 21. Congrats. It's a room. <laughs> Flipped over tables, some boxes, rocks. You see a broom. Okay, wait. I go Let... Let my You also notice the sexual tension between average human man <laughs> Steven. <laughs> And uh, Elizabeth teardrop, but oh, but it's mostly it's like ninety nine percent coming from just Steven though. If I see that, I do like a cartoon wolf, like wolf howl as I look at Steven to Elizabeth. Like so, when you do your cartoon wolf howl, uh oh, you uh, come on, get... <laughs> and then I duck for cover. Why are you ducking for cover, boy? You yep. see her again. Ah, oh, damn it! As soon as I see her, I want to point at the bird. <laughs> Silence. And she goes away. I would, uh, Big Boy would like to go up to uh, Sneaky and give him a good shove for that. Sneaky Raven's okay. gonna bop you on the head with a broom for that. <gasps> Sneaky Raven is not near the broom. Oh, I said I meant to get the broom. Sneaky Raven goes to the broom. Do you do you just wanna keep the broom? It might be useful later on. Okay. Add library broom to your inventory, I guess. I use it you now have a broom. I use it to shoo away. Does Tyr see this interaction between these two? Yeah, we're looking right yes. at him. Oh, then, then she'll just kind of walk up and she'll take out the piece of paper and her chicken scratch. You can kiss and make up later. We've got a fucking book to deliver. And she'll kind of like crumble it up and put it back in her pocket. I take out, like I motion to, to want a piece of paper and charcoal. I'm just gonna go up and grab the raven and point at Elizabeth and point at Big Boy. I grab the raven's hand and just walk away. <laughs> I, I refuse to move. I leave I the counter. raven. I have 14 strength, boy. boy oh. I have a minus one. Well, Big, yeah. Boy, Big Boy's gonna follow the rest of the party to deliver the I'm, book. I'm joking, I'm going with them. If okay. possible, DM, um, before yeah. we make it into this hallway, Elizabeth would actually like to see if she can uh, stealth into it before they go on. They just get into this silliness. Um, roll, roll some stealth. So I kind of want her to kind of come up to here, do a little peek through with her good eye, and kind of turn the other way. We want to see what she does on that side. So to your right, you see a doorway with two statues. To your left, you see that there's a few desks, um, two other statues, and a stairway leading up. Do you want me to roll the stealth? Roll that stealth, I if would, you want to be stealthy. I'd like to look at the hallways as well, too, please. I'd like to be sneaky, too. I want you to know that I have proficiency in stealth, all this other shit, and blah, blah, blah. I rolled a 7 plus 4. Uh, so that's an eleven. Mm. So okay. you see that tear. She thinks she thinks she's she's in it. She just kind of looks at everybody. Oh, you just as she kicks a rock. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I rolled a ten, and so I have twenty-one my, for my stealth check. May I? Well, you're not exceptionally sneaky a sneaky group but uh may you what steven i wanted to look at the two different like uh do we s i'm facing the stairways how far off can i see before i, I need was to gonna perceive? Say that, um, it's that Elizabeth it's a little dark will... you guys are just based off of the uh I'm a roll. candlelight but i'm a roll some I was, perception I was say if, then roll if, if, if per if perceive elizabeth will actually kind of like do hand signs that she'll go she'll point to she'll do like that to the right 
I ain't going to do like a number two to go tell them there's two things there. Uh, I ain't going to point to the left and just kind of go see, upwards. I just seal hear, team six. All right. I just look at Elizabeth because I saw nothing. <laughs> Thinking you might be doing thieves can't, I start doing thieves can't back into you in response. Thieves can't what? I just like let me double check the phrasing because I think it specified it could be some. I tried to make it funny. Nobody laugh. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, I want you to know that I'm a little slow, but I just caught it, and it's just like, just oh, that was a good one. That was a good one. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just know. Uh, you said I'm like, what? So it's um, okay. I don't need your pity laughter. <laughs> so, Daniel, what did Teardrop say in sign language? Or Seal okay, Six? She just kind of points. She uh -huh. points to the right, and she goes and she does it like a number two. And she'll point to the left if she just does like this way. So I point to the left with a thumbs up and like and then I do two thumbs up? Cause <laughs> she, she 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 legit looks at you. Are we are we are we still are we still silent, by the way? Try talking. I try talking. Hello? So, quietly. It comes Hello? out. Oh, yeah. okay. oh dang. We can talk again. We should have tested that soda before we started doing all of this hand gesture stuff. Did you have to go to the bathroom where you did number two? I think you are you a fool? Steven, how long how long have we been doing this together? No, there's two fucking things that way. Well, there's uh, a fucking staircase. You just did going a number I thought the thumbs up was the right way. <sighs> okay. Well listen. Right way, there's two steps. On the left way, there's a stairway going up. I would imagine if I was a spooky, scary librarian, I would probably go and have some type of loft apartment type looking type thing. To watch over. And maybe... Yeah. Yeah, but... that's smart. That makes sense, miss. So, but... Miss. I mean, we... Are we here... Are you trying to flirt with her? Well, mister. Okay. Hey. Hey. Oh, be oh. nice. Hey, shit. No, just... Oh, Steven, standing his ground, <laughs> protecting what, what's his. M, M plus, the Ra I mean, Snakey Raven is cute and all, but it's not really my bag. Not that there's anything against you, but there can't be two rogues in a relationship. I wind up having to slit your throat in your sleep. But uh, she'll uh, just kind of point to... Uh... You see Steven, like, get really <laughs> nervous because he's a rogue? <laughs> I just be scared at you. Oh, really? Good to know. <laughs> just kind of... She turns over to the statues. Let's, let's go and check out the statues first. We'll go and see if there's some spooky, scary shit, and then we can go to the steps. I'm feeling I'll, dicey. I'll leave the... Um, I leave the you, weed this time, yes? You know what? All right. You feel free. Bird, Gotta be sneaky. Birdman goes first. I'm gonna be sneaky before I enter the door. Packing. Oh, um, where'd well, Nana go? It's, Where's, it's where'd Big Boy go? Where, Nana just, or where, not Nana, where did Big, Big Boy, Boy just went flying. I think he went flying to all the way to the left. No, where, just, where's Big Boy? I can't I find him. I, I, I can't find him. I saw By their the token stairs. just... Just me like, too. Zoom. Me too. All the way to the left hand side of the like. Oh, I found them. I, I brought them back. There you go. I just I like flung him show. across the, the room. <laughs> How Big did boy, you okay? That was secrets for that. Way. You can fly. So, um, sneaky. You try opening the doors. <clears throat> Is that what you're gonna do? I'm gonna attempt that. Carefully. They don't budge. Are there any locks? But yes, there's a, there's a keyhole. But as you start shaking those doors to open them, the statues start to shake a little. I jump and back. out from okay, you jump back, and out from them. Five feet. You see two animated armors appear. Um, are they appear in front of the statues or the statues become animated armors? It's almost like the statues are now naked and the armor that was on oh. them has come to life. Oh, how lewd. 
They are not ad- an- anatomically correct. Oh, Whoa. that's sad. And and if you notice, their their pants are not part of these tokens. So. Look helper. I look at them. Help with book. Hopefully. They take a fighting stance. I back up behind Steve. Time to uh, behind Steve. Okay. I would like to Meat note shield. it's Steven, not Steve. Don't you dare call me Steve. I I apologize. Oh, Steven. We're behind Steven. Where the, where the raven sneaks back behind Steven, Tyr will just kind of look down at him. Oh, you're brave as a shit. Go in first and run first. Huh? I see. And <laughs> it's just like... <laughs> Reposition. Reposition. You, you see, All right, I, my Steven, friends. Steven takes this Roll point for to initiative like, one more time. Steven We're doing takes it again. This point to like kind of bolster up a way to like one up the raven. 21, baby. I actually oh, did roll shit. a Oh, shit. 14. I think I might be last this time. Two! Oh, <laughs> Steve! Oh, Steve is last. Just just remember, it is the curse of the DM. I'm just waiting for the other shoe to drop. I'll go and I get two good rolls, and then after that, it's just going to be a crap shoot. It happens all the time. Yep. That's a fuck you, baby. Lock. Lock picking. Um, uh, Grim, what did you roll? Ten. Ten. Okay. I rolled a five. The order is armor one, then the pirate lady, then the cat man. <clears throat> After that, the bird man, the average man. The what? average man. And the other armor. I did no, better no. than someone with a two? Yes. You see, like, as, like, he takes this win, like, he did something, a huge feat. <laughs> two just. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing okay. He's doing alright. Good for you, Stephen. There we go. Yep, it was the armor first. Oh no. So that armor was looking at the bird. That'd be beautiful. But the bird hid behind the man. That's not for kitties. That's not for kitties, no. <laughs> and I guess that's not for kitties will be his last words. <laughs> that's, that's not, not for, for kitties. kitties. That's oh. not for kitties. No. <laughs> Steven. Yes. Does a 10 hit? No, it doesn't! I have 11! Oh, <laughs> you a lucky boy. <laughs> Steven in the absolutely fantastic day that we're going to write a fucking book about you. <laughs> <laughs> so you see the armor take a swing at you with that first hit, but misses. Another near miss. But the only reason that but doesn't hit has... is because I have leather armor on. But he has another hit. No! Another swing. <laughs> I'm actually going to activate an action point, and I'm going to use my Dread Pirate no. ability to activate the No, 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 no wait, wait, wait. Shh, shh. No. Ooh. I rolled the two. <laughs> then I don't do that. <laughs> if, <laughs> if you, if, if, since the DM called me out on it, then I'm, I'm going to I'm gonna cheat like it's the player weird. doing. The, the the monster just took one swing and missed, took another swing and completely missed, and it looks at its sword, and it realizes his sword's broken in half. Aww. The, the other yeah. statue quickly looks at his sword, and the, yep, <laughs> broken in half. I'm gonna stab him. Feels bad. It feels bad. It feels Teardrop, bad. it's your turn. Okay, but enough of that, you fucking cunt. And he's just, she's just gonna go over and up on him. You wanna go and attack the everyman, man. Alright. She's going to, uh, pull the... By the way, I have a very bad feeling that Steven might actually survive this night. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sad, I wanted to break in my other character. <laughs> I don't think you're gonna have a chance. <laughs> Why not? 
when the when the when the creature goes to go look down at its sword and kind of realize that it's broken, I yeah. would like to kind of like walk up, pull her rapier from from her side, and literally poke it into its eyeball. It's just like, oh, caught your eyeball. It's just armor. It doesn't have eyeballs. It's, you know, it's flavor to hit it. It's flavor to hit it. <laughs> <laughs> you that you is... hit where an eyeball would be. Ooh. That is true. And it that just is... goes pink with the back of its helmet. That is a 17 plus 5. Yes. Does it? You hit it. Ooh, 8 plus 3. Holy shit. I got excited. I'm sorry. I got excited. It's a 9 to 11. Uh, yeah, 9 to 11. 11 points. She'll just. It's like, oh, no, for that. Oh, no, for that. All right. Is that all you have? She's actually going to wait. She wants to see what it does next. She's not going to disengage or anything. She's going to stay right there. Um, It is Big Boy's turn. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Big Boy is going to cast Chromatic Orb. <gasps> What does that do? Uh, hurl a four-inch diameter sphere of energy at a creature you can see within range. You choose acid, cold, fire, lightning, poison, or thunder for the type of orb you create, <laughs> and then make a ranged spell attack against the target. If the attack hits, the creature takes 3d8 damage of the type that I choose. What type do you choose? Uh, what kind of armor is this? Is it metal armor? Yeah, it looks like if it was made out of iron, it would be your best guess, probably. I'm gonna choose lightning, then. Nice. Okay. Do the zappies. To which Zappy. one? Um... The one that's closest. Okay. Do it. Uh, okay. I'm gonna roll. Come on! Are we getting hit by this? Mm -mm. No, it's four inch diameter. It's, it's very precise. Don't worry <sighs> about it. This ain't. This isn't Nana from our other game who just <sighs> rec recklessly hits teammates. I cast fireball. I rolled. To to those watching, we play a game off of Twitch that I host. Which if and you want to uh, see, Harley's it, character. Oh, which sorry, if you want to see, we do it on Tuesdays, and you can actually join in and watch Miguel DM. Yes, join our Discord, and you can watch us play that. Now, Harley plays a character called Nana, a little old lady that doesn't really care about her teammates that much, and just <gasps> shoots area of effect attacks that hits everyone. Friendly Listen. fire for everyone. Listen. Nana is a wise old bird. She knows mm. that her party members will be fine. Okay? Oh, she they knows can, they can they take can the handle, hit, huh? They can yeah. handle a few scrapes and bruises along the way. And Poor. she will kiss their boo-boos if necessary. <laughs> but I play, Oh, I play sorry I set you on fire. No. I, I play a white dragonborn barbarian by the name of Loki, who is literally the damage sponge of that group. And yes. I want you to know that it is quite funny how sometimes the most damage I will take will be from Nana blowing me up. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Nana loves us. I don't. I don't like so, this line of attack. So I'm, I'm... <laughs> <laughs> Nana so loves back... all of her grandchildren. Right. That's it. Um, yeah. Blind observer comments. Look, do you want efficiency or do you want hand holding? Yeah. <laughs> you know, you yeah. know. Who's, whose turn is it next? Who, who fucking goes next? Come on, so, so, big boy, you were going to shoot a ball of lightning. Did you yes. hit? No, I Did you hit? rolled a six. It's a plus five, though. Oh. Then you gotta that's... make sure you add your hit DCs in. Eleven. Nope. Aww. Sorry. Armor's tougher than leather armor. Got it. It just kind of bounces off the armor. That's sad. Yeah. These things happen. I could have helped. When you. that, when that uh... happens, Tyr will just turn to Steven. What'd you do that for? That wasn't even necessary. 
I, I look at I my have... hands. I look back at you, horrified. <laughs> you're, you're a magician, Stephen. <laughs> is, that, is that the end of your turn, big boy? I have, I have a, bo a bonus action. Okay. Yes, do it. Uh, uh, actions in combat to, to weapon fighting. Just gonna take out two little daggers and... Wah! Just give All a right, good... Well, well, you're gonna have to move yeah. into range. Yeah, well... Can I do that? Please? You haven't taken a move action yet. You can. Well, that's my move action. I'm doing that. Okay. Let's see if you hit them with, the, with your little daggers. Please, please, please. Give him a break. He's <laughs> old. 18! 18 hits. Roll that damage now. Roll that damage! Give him a break. Damage. He's old. <laughs> oh, no! I got a what? two. Two damage is two damage. Well, <laughs> hit points are hit points, baby. It's all good. Alright. Is that the end? Yes. Sneaky, your turn. I will go up to the same same one. Okay. Stab him with my rapier. Or stab at him with my rapier. Roll! 14 hit. A 14 does not hit. Mm. Oh, I tried. Uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Excuse me. And by the way, I'm so glad that you decided to be brave and leave from behind the cover of Steven. I have my cutting action. Thank you very much. Cutting act, cutting act, disengage, back up just a tick. I'll be next to Steven, but not behind Steven. Oh, okay. Still within range to use him as a human shield, huh? So I have to know I'm giving the other one options. <laughs> is that the end of your turn? That's my turn, yes. Steven, show us what you can do. I'm going to walk yeah. by the raven and I'm going to do this as I walk by. <laughs> Just middle <thing. laughs> I'm going to walk okay. over right here. Uh -huh. And I'm going to walk forward, but not leaving. Attack for, attack, attack for opportunity. But it's room for others to get in there. And I'm gonna draw my rapier, and I'm gonna slashity slash. The feisty meat shield says, "Mr. Stardust." <laughs> this way, the raven can't get behind me. That is a I sixteen. Re I, I read that. Right you missed. When you said it. I missed. Ooh, with a sixteen. Oh, yeah. oh no, oh, guys! Oh, they shit. they are armor. Oh, they shit. Armor by chance. oh, that's not good. Oh, shit. oh, okay, so that was my action. I'm going to do two weapon oh, fighting. You're, you're still okay. Uh, so drawing my dagger to do a finesse weapon uh, with my two weapon fighting, and we'll attack with dagger. my dagger. Hey yeah. Hey yeah. That's what happened. Yeah, says Stephen. Uh, that's a dirty 20. Ooh. It's filthy, but it hits. Yes. <laughs> yes. So dirty. I'm going to do the damage now. Hey, Menchie. You going to jump? That's three points of damage. Nice. Nice. And you leave a nice nice little scrape on, on his uh, armor. Nice. That's my turn. All right, it's now the other armor's turn. And he's going to go for the human man because he's the closest. That's fair. Safe next to me. And let no me bring back the to sheet. Before Does they it... make. I, I was... Okay. Right Go before ahead. that happens, I'm going to enact the feat of Sentinel since he's making a melee attack against someone within 30. Um, forgive me, I think it's 30 feet or 5 feet. Uh, oh, 5 God. feet. It's just the tile of difference. They're, Wait. they're not within 5 feet of you. No? Or is it what? 
Is it within it's, five feet of you? Yeah, it's um, it would be it's it's, it's from, to Stephen, so it's just a tile in between us. So, since they go to go and attack, uh, am I am I am I ruling this right, no, guys? Because I've never used Tentadon. You are correct. So right when they go to go do the attack, I use my reaction to get an attack on him. You're welcome. <laughs> and I miss. There I miss is like a, a tile. I miss there like is a, a, a tile and a half between you guys. Oh, that's over five feet. Well, then shit, then I don't fucking do a goddamn thing, and, and Steven's just gonna get punched in the face. That's, that's fine. <laughs> so, Steven, there's a 12 hit. <clears throat> yes. Oh, no. Oh, Steven. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I have, I have a special thing, a majig. Hold on, just a moment. Everyone's trying their best to protect Steven. <laughs> I, I would like I'm to done. point out meta knowledge to the players. Steven is meant to die, so don't waste your good <laughs> stuff on Steven. We don't know that, Steven. You hush your face. Sneaky <laughs> Raven. Steven. You are a valued member of this team. <laughs> you make the the best hotcakes. Aww, <laughs> how'd you know that, DM? <laughs> I'm God. <gasps> <laughs> okay. Um, but since since my it. fighting style is interception, I can reduce the damage Ooh. that a target takes now, as a reaction. What is the range? For you to be able to do that, it doesn't say because there is about ten feet from you and and Steven. Oh wait, five feet. The, the gesture... So blind observer says, "Oh, so Steven is the standard issue Bioware tutorial party member." I get it, <laughs> Steven. You are so fucked. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're not wrong. Mi Mr. Stardust says, ha, get fucked. <laughs> I love this oh, so man. much. So I'm gonna I'm gonna roll my, my damage, I guess. I don't think any of you can uh, stop this. Can't stop it from happening. You take seven damage. <gasps> Guys, I'm still alive. That was the first hit. I have twenty eight HP. We're okay. With my second hit, not not the best, not the best last words. That's usually that I, well. <laughs> I rolled a thirteen, so I'm I'm no! pretty sure I hit you. <laughs> Told you that's just not that really isn't what you should have said out loud. And you only take three damage. Hey, I I'm still crap. kicking, guys. <laughs> and that's the end of that armor's turn. It goes back to the other armor. No! <laughs> and it's quite miffed that it missed you the first time. So he turns around and takes a swing at you. I'd like to activate my With thing. an 18. Fine. I allow it. <laughs> God damn it, you take three damage again. I'm still alive, guys! Steven, you're a tank of a man. You're a fucking tank of a man. <laughs> you did cuts. You're gonna make it through this. You got this, Steven. <laughs> the second hit doesn't doesn't touch you. Holy shit, Steven. <laughs> I I want to like let out this battle roar. <laughs> oh I'm sorry, Munchie. Oh, poor Munchie. You right. you done Ooh. you done it again. Oh fuck. <laughs> <laughs> the librarian appears. Oh god. The not... librarian appears. Oh no. I'm sorry guys. <gasps> Big boy. I'm so but... Sorry. Oh hey, you get fucked. Right, right, right when she gets silence. <laughs> you just get get fucked. <laughs> And she's gone. I'm so sorry. You need so much uh, somatics and speak verbals for your spells. 
Oh shit, that shoots. Oh boy, that's so, <laughs> Teardrop. I'm a bird. It's, it's your turn. It's. <sighs> I'm going to. Uh, M, can you zoom in a, l a little bit on your camera? Oh, yeah, I can do that. Yeah. Oh, too zoomed in. There we go. It gets okay, blurry. Okay, perfect. I need, I, need to give, I need to give this a little bit of space. Um, so adjust the uh, that white marker on the right. Uh -huh. Lower it a little. And you can get closer. It'll be less blurry. Really? Low, I... Lower and move your camera closer. I'm just... Oh, I see. Cool. Ah. I there would actually like to uh, disengage. And I'm going to disengage. Does Here that we... not prompt an attack of opportunity? There's a cunning action for thieves, and I can do that without provoking attack of opportunity. Okay. Because she's a and... sneaky motherfucker. So I I would like her I would like there we go I'm gonna go and and as she's walking backwards she's gonna do item interaction she's gonna go and and uh, toss the rapier into her offhand go and and go from the hip and go and grab her pistol like okay you fuck but and she's just gonna word it like. <laughs> Do you see it? Do you see the natural twenty? Oh, I see the twenty. I say this natural twenty should be dedicated to Mr. Stardust. Mr. Mr. Stardust, Stardust, I want you to know the this fucking hole is about to blow into this piece of shit is yours. Um, so give me one, one hop. You get one hop. <laughs> Oh, doing that them hard maths. Oh. Stop it. That is thirty-one points of damage. Oof. When you shoot from the hip. <gasps> That's not for kitties. You don't hear it. The bullet is silent. And it just goes. And when it hits the armor, it just completely falls into pieces. The bullet or the armor? The armor. Yes. Just Ooh. falls on the ground. Why not both? It's no longer animated. She just turns she just turns to Steven. <laughs> I would like to retcon and say that he automatically put his fingers in his ears expecting there to be a loud bang. <laughs> 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 Big boy, it's your turn. Oh, I'm so um, sorry. I would like to... Blind Observer just observes. I just noticed that this party is three rogues and, and a magic cat. <laughs> who is taking the place of Jory from Dragon Age once he finally dies. <laughs> That's amazing. I want you all to know that I was thinking that when we when I started noticing everything, when this shit goes down the toilet and we have a real physical combat, we're <laughs> fucked. <laughs> just, I just throw that out there to you. We're just weaving in and out of combat. There's be so many cutting actions that back all the way up. Big boy, what are you doing? Uh, I'm gonna run up to it and give it a good bash with my my, uh, with your staff. My cool staff. Nice. Okay, so move up to it. And bash him. Big Boy is a wizard, but he does have a level in fighter. If you, it makes level. you feel better. My longest running campaign, I was in had a party... Of, of a bard, a rogue, a warlock, and a sorcerer. No one could heal. Ouch. <laughs> so, oh, I did, did I, I notice that you uh, selected oh. the action in game to, to attack him, but you still need to roll. Yeah, I did. I don't I even did. know if you hit him yet. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> My bad. 
Big boy's just super excited. 18. <laughs> 18. Oh! 18 does that it. Hit. Okay. That hits. I gotta roll for damage. On. Come on. 16. <laughs> plus. You says, do. Plus proficiency, oh, plus. right? Plus proficiency. Wait, yeah. no. it's, it's, that, it's an attack roll? Is that is, yeah. attack roll? So, uh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay, well, I 18 already hit, so just 16 then. Okay. You did that damage. You heard it. You see the, the armor just kind of shakes, wobbles a little. Good job. Can, can, can I get what she says? Good job. Does it sound out, or? It does. <gasps> Yay! Oh, oh. Maybe you should have Is that the end of your turn, big boy? Uh, I think I also have react uh, another bonus action I can do. Yeah. <laughs> I'm. By the way, I'm sorry, but the silence will lift after big boy's turn. Oh. So if you're going to do magic, it's not going to work. Well, we know that your uh, bonus action, I don't believe it's... Oh, bonus actions are magical. No, I believe it's uh, its visual and somatics to do the shadow blade that you did earlier. So... Yes, it is. So I would like to do that. Shadow blade, please. Shadow blade. I love this spell so much. It deals... Uh, wait. Blah, 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 2d8 psychic damage when it hits. This... So, roll to hit. Yes? Wait, what? I'm sorry, what What are you doing? Uh, my bonus action of <clears throat> Shadow Blade, which is not, it's not voice, I don't think. I believe is it? it's just visual and somatics, if it's I just remember. visual and somatics. Okay, you do that. So, um, if you're going to do that, it's going to affect both the armor and Steven. Bring it. Be <laughs> Nana and embrace your Nana. And also sneaky helper. I'm I, don't, I don't really care about the... <laughs> he doesn't care about birds. You are in the square right next to him. Oh, that was unintentional. I will tell you kind. I not take kind so, of the fire. So what is the save everyone needs to make before you start rolling damage here? Everyone but Teardrop. Yay. Uh, everyone but Teardrop. <laughs> so wait, what? I'm sorry, I was responding. What do, what do we have to do? Right. We have to do dex save? This or? is a dex save of how much? Oh, I rolled a 20. Uh, I'm looking for it. I don't remember. I I'm, I'm glad you rolled a 20, but we don't know what we're rolling yet, so... Your role is invalid. I believe it just happens. Yeah, it just happens. It doesn't say. You, when you read the description earlier, you said that, you, that the character has the other characters have to do a save. That was the. Or is that this was a, a different, different spell? That was a different. That was a cantrip. Oh my! My apologies. Oh. Then. Okay, I have to roll it. My I rolled a natural twenty. Ooh. God damn it! Wasted. Holy Wasted. Shit. Like to dedicate that twenty to nobody because it was for nothing. Well, I'm dedicating this nobody roll to uh, blind observer. <laughs> blind observer, you get the honor of a twenty that was wasted. My apologies. So what what does this spell do then? I'm sorry. Um, um, it deals two d eight psychic damage on a hit, and has the finesse, light, and throne properties. In addition, when you use the sword to attack a target that is in dim light or darkness, which we are in, uh, I make the attack roll with an advantage. Blind Observer says, thank you? <laughs> Alright, so roll to hit. That I already did, but okay. Well, oh, well, what did you roll? I didn't hear it. Well, uh, that's what it, it said. Then you missed. Boo. Wait, you rolled to hit with Shadow Blade? That just automatically hits. Oh, no, I didn't. No, you're right. It just automatically hits. You just rolled damage. 
Okay. It counts as then a roll, my land. If, if that's how it works, then roll well, no, damage. Reread it, Harley, because I, I don't... Because know. I heard that, that the text say, on hit. I will read it from the very beginning. Here's what the paragraph says. You weave together threads of shadow to create a sword of solidified gloom in your hand. This magic lasts until the spell ends. It counts as a simple melee weapon which, with which you are proficient, which I am. It deals 2d8 psychic damage on a hit and has the finesse. And it's, has... it's just a weapon. It's just it a weapon. doesn't hit automatically. Okay. Hmm, I've been doing so you need wrong. to roll to hit. Okay, all right, I'm rolling. I'm going to do it. Here I go. Oh shoot! It was a five. Now, does it give it any eight hits of DCs bonuses? Because I don't recall it giving any hit DC bonuses. If that were the case, I don't know if I can help you at all. It's been a while since I've used it. If this is dim light, you get advantage. You said correct. This is dim light. This is. Yeah, okay, roll again. Roll again. Wait, you get dim light. I'm just gonna get the spell up and look at it. Well, which doesn't hit. <laughs> doesn't hit. Sorry. Is that the end of your turn? Yes, that's oh. it. That's all I got. S sneaky boy, your turn. I will shoot. How does shadow blade work? Actually, shoot yeah. with what? My bow. <laughs> Taking up my bow to shoot it. <laughs> Ew. A 15? 15 does not hit. Oh, I tried. That's Sorry. The... Wait. Wait? Go for the fucking eyes, everybody. You gotta go for the non-existent eyes. <laughs> yeah, no. I'm good. I prepare my... I know what I'm gonna do next turn if I can... Steven! Bullberry for Yay! What's that? Okay. Uh, I am going to, not much I can do, but let's do it. Attacking with my rapier. Let's see if I hit. I want to slice at the non-existent people. I want to see if you hit. I want you to <gasps> hit. 22! Nice. You nice. hit. Steven, the hero. Fucking Steven. Holy shit. Rapier, open and tail spire. Steven, I, <laughs> Steven. I believe in you. Come on! I believe in you, That's five points of damage. Nice. Sneak attack? Because. Um, I'm. We're not flanking him, so we can't use sneak attack. Okay. Good job, Steven. I'm very proud of you. Thank you. I finally, I finally did something useful. Actually, no, I did damage do you on the have, other guy. Wait. I did damage on the other guy too. Don't forget. Zombie. Yes, you yeah. did. Yes. Yeah. Uh, now, right is this deep. the end of your turn? Now I'm gonna do oh, my no. second attack with my dagger. Okay. Uh, Make it count. Come on, open tail spire. <laughs> I have a bad fucking feeling because the DM saying that was perfect. That's a nine. But here. Well, you, can't have you, you just can't. You just can't have everything. It's just not. That's not so it goes. It's the armor's turn. Well, shit. I I do hope you enjoyed your your heroic moment. I really did. Oh, no. I really did. <laughs> First hit is a miss. Yes. I'm gonna take Steven. my second. Pull and weave. Pull and weave, Stephen. Pull and weave. <laughs> <laughs> Uncanny dot, Steven. Uncanny dot. 17. Dead hits. Oh, I don't... Oh, that, you didn't bob that one. You, you, you uh, weaved when you should have bobbed, and, and I'm so sorry. That That's gonna hurt. I, I am so sorry. Wait, Let's see. God damn it. <laughs> Three damage. <laughs> I Again, I want to let out a scream. You you, you let out a scream again? Yes. I was stabbed <laughs> myself. You're in <laughs> Big boy Guess definitely glares at you this time. Back again. <laughs> Librarian. Silent. Sorry. Sorry. 
You can't say sorry no more. <laughs> I'm now she's gone. Against... <laughs> sorry. <laughs> that is the end of the armor's turn. Elizabeth Teardrop. Since they're doing all this flanking over here, you mean now that I'm going to be behind this creature? Yeah. Now Elizabeth they're just would, flanking. Elizabeth would like to go and do a little bit of a sneak attack on this. Do it. Come do it. Summoner. Everybody, let's go. What did you roll? 9 plus 5, 14. Sorry, buddy. She, she goes to go swing. It goes like in the in the empty space where there's like nothing in the armor. Oh, I, I think oh. we just lost uh, Grim. Yeah. Oh. There we go. Uh, okay. Um. You... M. Are the cameras okay? Yes. Okay. Cool. They worked for a second, so now they are. So yay. So right um, now so after that. Uh, what else you got here, Drop? Let's let's take a look and read a book because it's been a really long time since I played this character. Blah, 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 blah. Da, da, da. Fuck me. <laughs> what you doing? Not the goddamn thing. It's a uh, she, she literally goes. She she starts messing around with the sword and she and she'll just kind of say to herself like I should have just fucking shot the goddamn thing. <laughs> 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 But All right. she, she, she holds out where she's at. Big boy, your time to shine, baby. And <clears throat> are we still silent casted? Thanks you are. Steven. Thanks to Steven. Big boy's gonna look at him right in the eyes. Just he does. He avoids then... eye contact at all costs. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, I guess I'll bash with my. Uh, do another good bash. With my bashing with my, stick. It's my bashing my stick. Dick go bash. All right. You, Roll for bashing. Now you do know. Uh, I was calling you Nana. You do know as long as it doesn't have um, uh, verbal next to it, you're fine. I know. Okay. But big boy still doesn't appreciate the limitations. I'm sorry. He is a noble boy. I'm sorry. I do this just to mess with big boy. Fifteen. Fifteen? Fifteen. Oh, no. That this doesn't do it. On, this one fucking armor is gonna fucking murder all of us now. Well, uh, time for my bonus action of Shadow Blade again. Yeah. Alright, roll. But you never dispelled it, so you still have it. Oh, okay. Well, then, can I just use it then? Yes. Okay, I'm. I'd like to use it. Do it. Fuck. Ten. Sorry. Mm. This armor is hard to hit. You guys keep know, swiping like at the areas armor. that that are empty. I guess that's it. I guess I'm done. Sneaky, it's your turn. Back up just slightly and shoot it with my bow, thinking maybe if I get a better angle. Okay. Oh, you oh, back oh, up a little. 13. Is that fine? And you miss. Yep, doesn't matter. <laughs> oh. Is that the end of your turn? Uh. Yes. Steven, the hero. Yes. Gonna... Will you be the one to destroy this this armor? Probably not. Oh, Steven, go. I'm going to attack first with my rapier. Do you believe in you, Steven? Nicky Raven bleeds and not Steven. That is a seven. Oh. Nah, definitely not with that. Stop it, not, Nicky. Not so good, Steven. Not so good. And then with my bonus action, I'm going to be attacking with my dagger. Blind Observer says, the silence problem is annoying, but I'm sure I'll get made up for over time by years of long and close friendship from Steven. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know about that. 
No, I'm gonna live forever, but I didn't hit with that one either. Long as nope. that's with this one piece of armor. Our, uh... This one piece of armor just doesn't want to go. Is that the end of Steven's turn? Yes, it is. It's the armor's turn now. <laughs> it's still going for Steven. Oh, shit. It's really got it going for Steven. I understand. And uh, it hits you with that first one. Okay. Okay. Four damage. Okay, guys, I'm still good. I'm still good. <laughs> How are you still good? <laughs> I just... I'm so confused right now about what... The, Steven's a tank! T-Bite? <laughs> good. Holy I'm shit. I'm good! With that second one, you take seven damage. Oh, less good now, guys. <laughs> are, are you still with us? I'm still with Steven? you guys! Oh, shit. None of us can actually heal, can we? No, not that I know of. <laughs> um, Elizabeth Teardrop. Okay. <laughs> yeah. She was really oh. hoping that this was gonna go a little bit different for what for what it did. DVD okay. <laughs> I expected so, this to be over by now. <laughs> so since so since since we're still flanking, would I be able to go and get my sneak attack off on it? Oh. Um. Yeah. Yes. And Mistress Stardust says, "Quite a tank for someone meant to die." I know. Oh, <gasps> Gave him God, too many Jesus. hit points. 13 plus 5, 18 exactly. Thank you, God. Okay. You got it. What was that, Harley? Good job. I said you must have given Steven too many hit points. I guess so. Blind Observer says, I'm starting to think that y'all have this backwards, and all of you are red shirts, and Steven is the actual main character. <laughs> yes, so there's a possibility of that. So that's 11 plus 5, 16, 3. That's 19 points of damage. Nice. Is it finally dead? That's exactly what you needed. It's finally dead. I'm hoping. Thank goodness. Talk Steven, you live to see another day. You keep this up, buddy. You're going to level up. Then, uh, with, 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 the, with the final hit, I'd, if, if possible, I don't even, when she goes to go cut it and she sees it still kind of moving around. So just kind of like take like the handle of the rapier, like stupid fucking fucking my fucking armor, and just kind of keep on hitting at it. Like, <laughs> God damn it! Well, oh, all right. Door, start fiddling with the lock using my lock pick set. Sure, oh, you can do that. Big boy would like to look for I would like to. Just it's not unlocked. Oh, yeah, I, I'll start fiddling with it. I would like to just kick the armor repeatedly. Um, in that case, what? You you kick the armor, but it's quite hard. You take one damage. I'm dead now. Get the oh, fuck shit, out. Did you just die? <laughs> the, my God. Get the <laughs> fuck out. I said that joking. I was thinking of Viggo <laughs> Mortensen in Lord of the Rings, you know, like breaking his toe for kicking a helmet. I'm dead. Is Steven dead? Died. Is Steven dead? <laughs> So, let me paint the picture here. The bird man is, is, is trying to pick the lock. Meanwhile, Steven, trying to show off, kicks a helmet, breaks his toe, and then just collapses. I would like... Okay. I'm ready to do my tap scene. <laughs> I can't believe it. I want, I want my hand to reach out towards Elizabeth Teardrop and be like, I've always loved, and then die suddenly. <laughs> you always will. You're not dead yet. You gotta do your saves. <laughs> all, all, all I heard was the fucking clinking of metal. I didn't hear half of it. I'm not fucking dead for one hand, damn it. <laughs> Jesus oh Christ. My God. Oh my god. Around. Stop playing. Blind observer, I'm so glad that you find this funny because I find it fucking hilarious. Yes! <laughs> oh my I god! Think, I think I think Steven I think Steven's fucking dead. 
All right, Steven. Yes. We'll make those rolls. Roll me. Make make me those rolls. You got it. Let me take that one HP away. Sneaky, sneaky Raven sighs and tries to stabilize Steven using. No, let me make a death roll save. God damn it! <laughs> well, you fell off right. This off this right is that's. I'm joking. I couldn't. Blind Observer says I couldn't have written this better if I had tried. <laughs> Come on, that oh, one. Right. Come on. Oh, okay, no. I gotta do it in here. Twenty. Okay, let's see. Come on, that one. No, it's a natural oh, twenty. Twenty. <laughs> That's awesome. You got better. I well, sit up suddenly. You think I'm better? What's wrong with you? Kick the Jesus. armor again. <laughs> okay. I sit up suddenly. Okay. Wow. You. <laughs> Mr. Stardust you says won't. that is content <laughs> anime deaths right there. What the fuck just happened? <laughs> Steven, this has been an emotional roller coaster. I think I think we need to go break I for, think, for commercial. I, I need to and you like I, I need a break and like to contemplate life. <laughs> Wait, Steven, Blind Observer the... says, why do the gods just not want Steven? <laughs> I feel like Steve, like Steven went before the the, the real this guy. Like, take me, please take me. Don't make me go back. It's just like not yet. Not yet. Oh, it's Mission not your time. Ahead. It's just like no. Oh my god. Steven dies. That's when he just refuses to oh. die. Oh shit. Oh okay. my cheeks hurt from laughing. Okay. We'll be right oh. back, guys. We're gonna take a five minute break. We'll see you soon. We'll be back. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm gonna be gonna be like, I wish I didn't wake up today. Yeah. Yes. I wish I'd stayed dead. I wish I wish I was really dead. Dead dead. Ooh, wait, wait. Maha is going to ask them for a festive drink. <laughs> The rogue will look at Maha for a moment and then look at Ebenezer. Uh, we have. What do, you, uh, what do you like to drink in the rain and Windsor at this time of year? <laughs> That's the stomach. Beer. I drink beer. <laughs> would, would you like I'll, one? I will take one beer. <laughs> Beer for everyone? Beer for everyone? Oh, I'll Let take us... some mulled wine, please. Eyebrow. Because at this point I know, don't I? Yeah. Eyebrow. It's mulled wine! It's better than there! I'll Just take sorry. some milk and honey. Jeez. <laughs> Fire up beer. Actually, what am I doing? Yeah, that's what I'll do. If I was smart, I would have done one shelf to its fullest and completed it. That way, I wouldn't actually have to burn this on fire to the second shelf because it would have already been there. Oh. I don't require those much damage. It's still 38 to burn just now. Oh, she just knocked over that tree! What? That's pretty epic. No wonder she could break our uh, fossil. She can do whatever the fuck she wants. She's a strong, independent dragon lady. Strongest thing on this mountain. Uh. Oh, he really doesn't like you. Uh. Just roll a 26. <laughs> no. A 25. Oh, close. Just 
Jesus Christ. Did you actually roll a 20? A 25. 25. <laughs> because chaos has now it's begun adorable. to rage. I think my brain is breaking. Since I've turned like 30, I'm like, I'm just gonna do the, the, the thing I like, even if it's awful. Oh, like, that's not. No, no, you don't. Wrong you with that. I was gonna no, say, no, it's I not feel, that your brain I is breaking. Like you ran out of shits to give. <laughs> yes, yes. There are no more shits to give. Yes, look at it. It's wonderful. I think it's really. It, well, they talk. It might feel the facts. It is barren. It's barren. Exactly. <laughs> and like, I'll tell you something. I hit the age of 30. Maha's gonna look and be like, be happy you have hands. Oh, God. I thought even Wilbur's like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Maha's literally just thinking of Eric and like how sorry he oh feels. Oh my for gosh. Him. But yes, I mean, like unintentional intimidation. <laughs> extreme intimidation. <laughs> you see, he just kind of holds an eye for a second. I want, I want me hands and don't. Um, <laughs> He, he just starts to walk away. He, he literally just walks in between the both of you. Get out of my way! Out of my way! And he just goes and starts walking down. Just like, if I, if I see you again, I'll kill you. You hear me? got a bit rate working and sometimes twitch gets a little bit angry so we're gonna go and try this one more time as you may know me i am daniel or you may also know me as xanaris the dungeon master of the legion game that we play every thursday at seven o'clock eastern time my mouse to move it slightly <laughs> play that in real life absolutely 100 percent. i wish i could do this in real life um because I can do it in theory when on simple things, but like on my homework and studying, uh, no, I do it the hard way. <laughs> my ADD just kicks in. It's like, you're going to do this one thing perfectly. Picked up that wood and it floated into the sky. You son of a oh, it came down. Okay, thank you. 
mother of, I don't know, who would be a Viking leader? Maybe an adult. You, uh, scourge, yeah, you, you, you coward. You scourge the bottom of my boot. PC or PC as your character, who would it be? Wait, did we, did Emily say who, who, uh, yeah, who you praise? Who, who the was wild, your god? The wild mother, the green mother. Um, oh, But I've okay. been having entanglements with the black tongue god. Mm. For all of you, out of curiosity about the black tongue god, you'll stay with your curiosity. <laughs> no, because you won't I was get like, any information. The player is very curious. The Just go and know the... start we are learning how to transition between our scenes so with that i want to thank everyone for coming to frank just roll a 26 <laughs> no welcome back everyone we just went through an emotional roller coaster where steven survived an encounter set two encounters already Three, actually, Three. with monsters. Three. Three. Yep. The average human man defied the odds. <laughs> and at the end of that last battle, he decided to kick a piece of armor, broke his toe, and died. But gods said no. Also proclaiming oh, there that is love. Still, there is still more for you to do in this world. And you were brought back T from will, the brink of death. T will take a look at, at Stephen. <clears throat> Stephen. Yeah. As as blind observer puts it, Stephen, whom death forgot. <laughs> Trademark. She, she just she just she just she just <laughs> looks at Stephen's eyes. Stephen, I'm not sure you can die. Or as Mistress Tartha says, Stephen, the unwanted. Why? Oh, I am Ouch. a god. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa! Are you you okay there, Stephen? <laughs> yeah, you. Uh, it's, it's, I uh, have become a god. I feel tempted to stab you, but I'm doing the door right now. You're going to stab me? I was joking, but I'm, do I'm currently opening the door or attempting to. Uh, okay. If you don't say that. I'm thinking it. As much as you try to fiddle with this lock, it's not budging. It's a really old type of lock, something that you really haven't had experience working with. Try knocking. I guess I, I know, Blind I guess observer I... says Steven is starting to get a worrisome complexion about them. <laughs> Someone stomp oh. on his foot again to take him out. <laughs> <laughs> they, 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 redeem, they redeem hydrate. We need to hydrate. Everybody. Oh, hydrate! Oh, thank oh, you, hydrate. Mr. Stardust. Hydrate. We have to drink now for five minutes straight. Oh, Wait, I don't drink think I can for drink five that minutes much straight? Cranberry. I'm sorry. That's not how drinking works. <laughs> uh, I need to breathe. Oh, I am Jesus. fully hydrated. Thank you for keeping I, us safe. I, I don't have any Mr. To says, ah, the big toe is one weakness. <laughs> I, I knock True. on the door then and say, get book back in here? You get no response. I try to, redeem your, to redeem your hydrate, I'll go and I'll drink my water. Can I try, um, I guess, physically forcing the door? Using my crowbar. You're a raven with a crowbar, huh? Burglar's kit. I I don't think I I just don't think that this is what I. Wait, it, it you gotta think magically in these types of fucking things. We just got talked by magic. Listen. You know, we, we we just dealt with magic armor. Steven came back from death. Yeah, a whole bunch of magical <laughs> shit is happening right now. So most likely, 
we've got to do something magic to it. So there's still another path that we can go down, little one. And we can go and check that there, out and we can look. There, as you're saying that, the keyhole starts to glow a little. The same type of bluish glow, glow that came from the ghost of the librarian. We need to stick the ghost in the keyhole. Wow. <laughs> I, I, I don't think that's what we have. <laughs> like the librarian did to us before we couldn't talk for a little bit. Big boy would like to look for secrets. I, open, I, I like to you... investigate this painting over here. For secrets, for like secret buttons and levers and stuff. Roll a uh, perception. <clears throat> 14. Okay, um, you see that the painting depicts the same armor that you were fighting just now. But uh, that's pretty family. much it. I... They were family and we killed them. I examined uh, uh, the, code of, the code of art. No. My, I'd like to examine the statues for a hidden compartment, perhaps. I, I, I think I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna speak, yeah, speak out of terror, maybe, but I think there's another way to go. She'll say it again, and she sees if it, if it glows. It glows. Yeah. <laughs> your magic. No, Stephen, your magic is 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 rubbing off on everyone. It's it's one of those things. Don't worry about it. I think I think we need to just go down the other way, so because these doors are going to be persistent lizard fuckers. So. I'm I'm with I'm with um I was said my own name I'm with a teardrop. I'm on with this. Steven. <laughs> Steven is with Steven. <laughs> I think you're having if, brain damage there, Steven, from coming back from if, the dead. If if you like, I could go and 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 maybe patrol this a little bit first before you run down there, yeah. Do you want to back up or no? I don't know. Steven the Unbreakable. <laughs> Steven, you're spinning. Oh, God. No, no, you, 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 all of you can come with, but, you know, just let's try to be sneaky-like. Oh, yeah. We're a bunch of thieves. Stealth. Right? Yeah, we're, we're, I'm good at stealth. Stealth. Elizabeth would like to stealth. Thieves and I one see. wizard cat. I she would sneak. like to stealth her way down to the, where, the, oh. To, uh, to, I don't even know what that is. It's, um, this pillar. Like a here. pillar. Yeah. Can I roll for that? Yes. Eighteen uh, plus seven. Fuck yeah. Okay. Oh, you are invisible. My I friend. got a twelve, so I'm just stomping down behind Elizabeth. I rolled, I rolled a twenty-two. <laughs> um, what about big boy. Big boy. Fourteen. Okay. <laughs> huh? Slightly less sneaky, but you're still sneaky. Does you see the room start to kind of unfold? So what you see before you is to your right, a few desks with a few papers, and you see um, a bunch of bookshelves. Right in front of you, you see stairs that go up. She'll, she'll kind of whisper to, to everybody. I think we need to get up the stairs. Um, did she see any ghouls or anything like that over here? Like anybody else searching for books? No, not from from the angle that you're look at, staring at. You do see kind of like from the corner that there's two more statues like right in between these pillars. Oh, shit. I refuse to stop stealthy. So she's actually just gonna walk, and she's gonna walk up to the. Uh... Oh, that statue oh. just dropped right in there. And she just kind of walks up to them for a second. Hello, boys. Good evening. When you say that, oh, just... this one turns up to you. This one I'm adjusts itself a little. Big boy. Not in front of big boy. I don't trust big boy. And they say, I "Trust you." Hello. Hi. Hello. Hello. We are looking for the back office. It slowly 
rigidly moves its hand and points back the way you came. Well, the doors are locked. You wouldn't have to, you know, have to open that, would you? Points up. Is there anyone inside that place upstairs that we're going to get beat up by? Thumbs up. Ah, fuck. All right. <laughs> At least these are nice fellows. <clears throat> you, you know what? She, she actually does look at it. Well, thank you. Thank you for your kindness. We're just going to can I continue our way if that's okay? Oh, oh thanks. <laughs> they, <laughs> just, they, just they give you a little wiggle and they let you pass. Continue to speak on. She wants to see if she can um kind of brace herself a little bit closer to them and make her way up just a little bit. She doesn't want to show her whole body just enough to like she kind of lay down a little bit and look up to see if she can see anything in there. Oh, perception. She's actually pretty good with that. Give me one second. I used to remember the fucking tears. Oh, okay, there we go. One of the statues disappeared. 19 plus 6. 25. Holy it's... shit. I don't know why it disappeared on your screen. They're st both still there. Because we went outside for it. So we can... That's a 25 in total. It's paired on oh, line yeah. There, there is line of sight in this game. Oh. So, yeah. Depending on the angle, it, it appears or disappears. Oh, that's cool. cool. Because those are technically monster tokens. Ah. Okay, sorry, Daniel. What did you uh, roll? 25 in total. You see um, what it looks like to be a little observatory. And the ghost of the librarian is right there, peeking through the uh, through that telescope. This so map is beautiful. So, um, the librarian's in that room. We can give her the book. We must be quiet. I'm not gonna say anything. It remains sneaky. Actually, you know what? Tia's gonna try to be funny. And she's gonna sneak her way into the room. Okay. Mm -hmm. She's still I'm... looking through through the little peephole thing. There's a desk. There's a light behind it, and does she see that desk over here in the corner? Her back's to it. Hmm. Can I stealth up to that desk? Yeah. Oh boy. Okay. You got this. Oof. Seventeen plus seven, twenty-four. You're good. Do I see a key? Do I see anything on this fucking thing? You see a few books, a scroll. That's pretty much it. Since I'm so close to her now, can I look at her body to see if she's got a fucking key on her? No perception. Oh boy. Five plus six, eleven. You don't see anything. Just see the ghost. Um, big boy would like to sneak up to this these bookshelves over here. Do I roll? For okay, sneak? roll. Roll me a sneak. Sneak. Mm -hmm. Roll me a snack. Sixteen. Ooh. You're sneaky. You're up against that bookcase. Uh, do I see anything on this on these bookcase? Or anything on these shelves? It's a lot of books on astrology. Is that it? Yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay. Uh, I would like to look at the ghost and see if maybe there's a key on the ghost. Okay, do that. Oh shoot. Hmm. I want to sneak up as well. It looks like a ghost. <laughs> Roll me a sneak, Mr. Human Man. Okay. I was expecting that. I was hoping for that rather than carrying on my previous sneak. 
so this is a good thing. Dude, you're just gonna look at Steven. <laughs> Come on! Modern solution goes for modern problems. Ten! Oh no. Hey, that oh, is no. perfectly average for perfectly average human. Ah, oh, shit. But not for spectral figure who sees you mm. and just points. Oh, where's my camera? Points. Uh huh. And when she points. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh! And she disappears. And since she pointed at you, they're all looking at. Oh no. Steven. I, I want to, when I hear oh no whispered from Elizabeth, I want to look at you. No. I have spoken with death. I don't die to death. You're left if he survived this combat. This. Steven's Steven's having a little bit of an existential crisis. Everyone, don't don't let, don't leave him on his own. <laughs> Raven's still sitting back, thinking he's being sneaky still, because he has to move. Are we rolling initiative? Yes, we are. Oh. I did better on the stealth than earlier. Just ah, twenty-four. <sighs> Come on. Five. Okay. Well, come on, plus zero. Hey, 18. Ah. <laughs> nice roll. All right, let's see what my spookums they roll. Higher than me, I'm in danger. I'm being treated. You're all in danger. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm the one closest to the X. Oh, wait, the exit's closed. That's what the crowbar is for. Wait, the exit is closed? Remember the exit closed behind us when we entered the library? The main entrance. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were talking about the entrance you're standing in. I mean, you nope. could be a coward bird and run. All right. Let's uh, set up these turns. Well, actually, Big Boy was standing right next to you when you stealthed. So yes, yes, Big Boy knows where you are because Big Boy saw you. <laughs> Where I was. So first goes Grim, then goes Evil Spirit 4. So that's Grim, Spirit, then Evil Spirit 1, then Steven, the hero. The chosen one. Yes. Oh no, I think I'm going last. <laughs> Fuck. You're not going last. Because going you're last. going right after Steven. To avenge his death, I think. Yeah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> then goes uh, Spookums number two. <laughs> then Big Boy. And then Spookums number three. Excellent. And we start with... Which one's this one? Uh, sorry, give me a second because now I... I'm gonna have to rename these ghosts so that I know which is which. Well, give me you, a second. If you click on it, it will pinpoint which one it is. It's not doing it for me for some reason. Oh no, that sucks. Oops. I accidentally what hit that one. Steven's will made it disappear. <laughs> Steven, you're so powerful. I look at my hands suddenly. Yes! It's like that crazy big hunter dude from Good Omens. Oh god, yes. <laughs> you're uh, that dude now. Yes. He's completely tamed than, rather than in the books, compared to the books. Yeah. Oh, you missed your All golden right. opportunity to name those ghosts Inky, uh, Blinky, Pinky, and Clyde. Oh, you're right. I don't 
get it. I, I should have done that. that one. They're, they're the ghosts from Pac-Man. Blind oh. observer, golden coin to you. All right, so the first evil spirit, Spectre, is going to go for... Wait, did they roll higher, 20 higher than me? Yes. Oh, man, they have higher than me. Oh, wait, no, sorry, oh, my bad. Heresy. You rolled a 24. I'm like, my God, you go, you go first, go. sorry. My bad, my bad. I was like, wait a sec. Um... Steven, you lived for another turn. Yes. Oh, shit. That, which is the ghost that goes right at Aki? I'm just gonna keep the closest ghost with my bow and arrow. So, okay. So, just out of curiosity, this one? Does a 16 hit? Yep. Yeah, um, right. yeah, 16 hits. And you said, um? Is that something else or is that to that? Oops, wrong person. That was, supposed to, said... come... that was supposed to come from him, sorry. All right, roll your damage. Fine damage, and so are we rolling with flanking, or are we going with the standard rolls? I'm gonna say you're not flanking it. Cause I, I was gonna say if we're going by normal rolls. Uh, of of what? Just the non-option was what the only one I was referring to. Okay. Well, are you talking about what, what, oh, your... Grim, what are you talking about? For sneak attack. Okay, you you want to do sneak attack. Quite. I don't think you're in the position to do that right now. Very well. I will bonus act and... I will move back a little and still. If you move back, you're back on the stairs. I know. So you're not going to hit anything with, with your bow and arrow. Well, I can't. I shoot twice anyway. So my bonus action for stealth is I, once I move, maybe five feet back, I roll twenty-five. If I may, I think you meant mechanic-wise, not being able to shoot off from stairs. Lineup server says someone friendly has to be adjacent to get sneak attack damage. That or you have surprise, right? Yep. So if you're the one next to Big Boy, that's what I was referring to. Next to Big Boy? So, so the enemy doesn't have to be uh, flanked? No, it does not have to be if you're concealed. Okay, which Grim is concealed. So, okay. Then yes, you get it. And I rolled 14 for sneak attack. All right. I back up and get concealed again. So I can be sneaking next turn to do it. Now, that 14 was the damage? For sneak attack alone, yeah. Okay. It, uh, that was including the other damage I did before that, which I believe was 9. Let me check, though. Yeah, it's 9 from the bow, 14 from sneak attack. So 23 in all if you need it. Okay. I'm speedy. All right, you hit that spookums. And I back up flight that... and sneak again so they can't see. Aren't as likely to see me so I can do it next turn. Okay. So you're backing it down on the stairs? Yep, five feet back so oh. I can bonus action sneak and I rolled a 25 for that. Okay, you're good. It is... That same spook that you hit, it's their turn. And Steven, you must be blessed by some kind of god. Oh no. Because they're going for big boy. <laughs> oh, cool. oh no. Can I But do... the immortal man's right there. I'm the immortal a... man's <laughs> right there. May I use a free action of speak to yell at, <laughs> yell at the ghost? No. Yes. <laughs> I, yes, you may. I would like to look at the ghost and say, "You coward!" When you do, <laughs> no! <laughs> what did you think was gonna happen? 
saving if we survive this, I'm going in the library. <laughs> and she goes away again. Good job, Steven. The hero. I forgot about that, I'm sorry. Yeah. I was hoping to I was hoping to get him to attack me instead of you, big boy. So, big boy, you see this this spectral being start to reach out to you. Ow! Oh, sorry, my cat, you are very sharp. You get to play <laughs> over there. I could hear the piercing. <laughs> a nineteen hits you, doesn't it? Uh yes. I'm sorry, it's actually a twenty three. Oh, uh! So you get smacked with you get eight necrotic damage. Ooh. Now you must succeed on a DC ten Constitution save. Or okay, oh so no, get oh no, higher than ten. Higher than ten higher than for 10. Constitution. It'll be under your saving throws on the left hand side under your image. I see it. I see it. Oh fuck! Nine. I'm just one short. Oh. You you rolled, and with your constitution, it's a nine. Yes. Well, that's a shame. Because this says. Oh no. If you fail. Hit point maximum is reduced by an amount equal to the damage taken. <gasps> so you, your maximum hit points goes down by, what was the damage I said? Um, eight. Said eight. And this is going to last until you have a long rest. Oh. That sucks. Oh, you. Blind observer says, "If big boy dies, we riot." <laughs> yes. Oh no. Oh, shit. So what? I go down to eight hit points. No, 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 no your no. maximum. You do lose eight hit points from the attack. Okay. But that your maximum number of hit points, go. Re, you lose eight of that. It goes down by eight. Oh, okay. All right. So until I rest, then I am. Yeah. I have less. My maximum is less. Yeah. Yes. Now you okay. can actually click on your maximum HP. Like mine says max twenty eight. So I click on that, and you can override max HP. You can edit that right there. Uh, temp HP. Uh, no, max, max HP. Yeah, max HP. Yeah. Uh, so that's the first hit, so it'll probably continue to just be the 28. Yeah. All right. All okay. Right, while you do that, this Spookums is going to go for a teardrop. <gasps> oh, oh, hey. And Jeez. Tear, <laughs> teardrop, you see it starts to extend its creepy little hands at you. I want you to know that Teardrop's dodge is going to be her going, They're fucking touching! They're fucking touching! Does a five hit you? Thank God, no. Jesus. So, yeah, you do the... I don't know what the hell you Oh, shit. It's time for the hero. So, after seeing... Ah, uh, God, I don't know who I would protect in this situation. Okay, I know what I'm going to do. Um, I'm now, gonna... that that one right in front of you did take damage from from the sneak attack earlier. Right. 
I don't see Elizabeth, so I'm not going to metagame. Dang it. I'm going to jump on the back of this ghost. Hope you don't go right through. I hope so, too. So, five feet to move right up onto it. You... Okay. Do I fall right Why... through the ghost? You... It's... It's like... Imagine jumping into, like... Jello. And you just got it, but you're starting to slowly seep through. Ew. Okay. From but in, you're on there. From inside of it, I would like to stab it. From inside of it, okay. You said I'm like in Jello. I would like to. We're not like in yet. Chaos. But... Um, so, I'm not going to make you roll unless you want to try for a crit. But I'm gonna say you hit it I wanna because try you are inside of this thing. I'd like to try for a crit. Go for it. <laughs> Come on, natural twenty. Oh, yep, yep. We're not. We're gonna ignore that right there because yep, that mm -hmm. wasn't a natural twenty. <laughs> yep, that sure wasn't. <laughs> and now I will roll my damage. Open tail square. Come on. Three damage. Blind Observer says you should phrase that somehow else because I hated all of that. <laughs> I mean, you know, sometimes you just crawl up inside someone and you feel all their warm, gooey insides and you feel the need to stab them. But if they're dead, shouldn't it be cold and gooey? Yeah. Which so, is immediately worse, uh, by the way. Wait. Cold Which and gooey is, is yep. way worse than warm it, and it gooey. It is cold, yeah. So, yeah. so I'm sorry, I, I missed it. What? What was it, the damage? Oh, does anyone remember? Because my die is three. Gone. Thank you. It was three. Thank you. It was three? Yeah. Yeah. You killed it. Oh! <laughs> you hear Steven turn around, That's stand up. up. Yeah! You see a slimy Steven <laughs> as the, the specter disappears. This Elizabeth is beginning to wonder what the hell's happening now. It's just like, dear God. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so I open my mouth to scream, but I'm imagining it's just silent, but I want everyone it's to It's just silence. <laughs> take sneaky Raven's credit and get a stab to the back eventually. Teardrop, it's your turn. Oh, shit. Okay, so once, once um, I go and uh, she hears uh, uh, um, Steven just do his battle cry. Oh, you didn't hear it, but you saw them try. Oh wait, that's right. But we're just like... <laughs> Elizabeth will kind of turn to the side, and when she sees that the thing's still there, um, she uh, she's gonna actually go with her offhand. Wait, mm, I'm gonna do this. Oh, you know what? No, she's gonna fucking get some distance between her and this piece of shit. She's gonna literally start. She's gonna go and disengage using cunning action. And as she's walking past, she's gonna go and f throw the rapier to this hand, go and pull out the pistol. She's just say, Oh, hey, touch this, dickhead. Yes. 14 plus 5. 19. That hits. Yeah. Ten points of damage. Yes. You get him. Um, once uh, once once she goes and she gets a shot out, uh, she'll go and she'll turn oh, to the others. Twenty three test cat says, "Dang, sneaky Raven really is just a murder hobo." <laughs> um, she, when uh, when she does that, da -da 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 -da. Oh, wait, no, I, that, these are all reactions. I cannot do that. Uh. Oh, actually, you know what? I would like to activate Walk to Plank. Ooh. It is a bonus action. As a bonus action, you can expend one dread point for taking the attack action to force a creature to make a wisdom saving throw. On a failed save, your next attack against a creature is granted the effect sneak attack. And I would like to do it on the one 
that's right by um the one that has not you know what no it's gonna be the, the same fucker i just shot okay uh they have to do a dc will save of 12. come on motherfucker. four oh, yeah that's good, good. Oh, what happens my next attack i get to do a sneak attack on him no matter what i'm doing okay is that the end of your turn that's the end of my turn i've 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 burnt up my uh my bonus action i have a reaction left that's all i can do but it's I'm, time I'm... for this other evil spirit and it's gonna touch steven bad touch it's bad touch reaching bad touch and now reaching for steven I don't like this bad touch. With the 19. Oh, oh damn! No. I'm going to use my reaction. <laughs> I'm going to use my reaction to belay that. It is within 30 feet. I've literally spent up all my dread points now. When a creature within 30 feet of you takes an action, you can expend one dread point as reaction in order to make a single melee or range attack against that creature. On a successful attack, the target must succeed on a constitution, saving throw, or lose the action for the remainder of the round. This attack only grazes the target and does not cause damage. So I just need to hit it. It won't it won't hurt him, but if I hit him, he can he won't be able to touch him. <laughs> Mr. Starda says, show us on the doll where he touched you, Steven. Fuck Steven, I'm sorry, I rolled a two. At least it wasn't I, a nat one. Oh I yeah, uh, I rolled a two. Fuck. I, I missed Steven. I All right. appreciate it. I... I'm sorry, Steven. Okay. Fuck. Okay. Titanic. So, Titanic soundtrack. So, six damage. Six damage. I'm not, like, I'm making death saving throws, but I'm not done then. <laughs> and, um, you need to make a constitution save of ten. Uh, I believe I do that at disadvantage. Because I'm unconscious. Okay. Oh, no. All right. So the first one is an eight, because I have zero uh, constitution. Mm -hmm. Just lost another another death save. Fuck. Well, this is a constitution saving throw. This isn't a death saving throw. Oh, so, okay, okay. So it's an eight. And, All right. And so your hit points go down by... Fuck, I just forgot what I what I just said. Does anyone remember? It goes down by half, you said, I think? Six no, points. it goes down by the same damage you just six. took. Oh, shit. It was either it was six, either six or, or eight. seven. Or... Six. Oh, we'll do eight. Uh, let's we'll say oh eight. six. Okay. 22. It's six. Okay. Um, and so I'm going to do my first death saving so, throw. Yes. Bring on that 20. Come back to us. It's a pass, but not a not a resurrection. Okay, that's good. No, that is that turn. Big boy. Yeah, big boy. Turn. All right. Um, I am going to make a move in between these two spookums, and I would like to cast my cantrip. Sword burst, which um, is within five feet, so it should hit both of them. Um, does the silence affect this? No, it's vision. Okay. Um. So, this is the one that surrounds you with blades and anything within yes. five feet. Yes, has to make a dexterity saving throw of at least fourteen. Oh, that would be those two ghosties. Said constitution? Dexterity. Dexterity. Yeah. The first one makes it. And the second one also makes it. No. Oh. All right, then I'm going to use my bonus action. My shadow blade. Yes. Shadow blade. <laughs> um... And I'm going to stab the one that is currently targeting Steven out of revenge. Big boy loves All right, the one me. behind you. I will avenge you. Big boy loves Roll me. to hit him. Ah. Four. Low 
light, so advantage. Don't do it. Yeah, low light. Oh, so that's advantage. true. Try again. Thank you, Grim. Ten. Does ten hit? Nope. Sorry. Oh. All right. That's all I got. Okay. Evil Spirit Three. He is right behind you, and is going to try to touch you. No, not the bad touch. Leave big boy alone. Poor old man. Does he touch you with a 12? My armor class is 12. Oh, if it means it beats. It beats. Sorry, honey. That's what I have to say about that. You take six damage. That's not too bad, I guess. And <laughs> you have to make that 10 constitution save. You got this. You got this. Twelve. You make it. So you only take Ooh. the six damage and that's it. Thank goodness. Sneaky Raven. Sneaky your Raven. turn. Pop up from behind the corner and see that Ste Steven is down and shoot at the specter attacking Steven. Since I'm still sneaking. Oh, cool. Bro, my friend. Twenty-six. That hits. So. What's it, that damage? Nine from normal and then sneak attack. Thirteen, so twenty-two all in all. Damn. And then I step five feet back and s stealth again, so I can attempt to do it next turn. Okie dokie. Roll a 22 for stealth. I've been rolling lots of 11 just for stealth. Why go? We go back to Evil Spirit 1, 10, 15. I would like from see. in my death to do this to the ghost. Just that yeah. for a second. Mm -hmm. that me again. Like, I should have let you die. And it is coming for you, Elizabeth. And it reaches out. Oh, sorry. Ah, fuck. And it doesn't touch you. I rolled a four. Oh, 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 shit. <laughs> Wait, can we talk again? Oops. Do we hear Elizabeth? Yes. Hey. You hear Elizabeth. <laughs> you hear the, oh, shit. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Steven. Yes, I'm going to make that roll. Are you, are you still with us? Come on, that one. Two. Two. Oh, fail. So uh, close. Uh, uh. And that ends All my right. turn. Teardrop. Your target's right behind you. Using, based on what we did the round before, I do get my uh, sneak attack on him. Oh, yes, you I do. Hope, I hope to Christ. So when he goes to go in and extend his hand, when she's like, shit, fuck it. He's just going to get like the gun up underneath his ghostly chin and just say, like, touch this. 17. That's with advantage? Oh, wait. No, 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 no. I, I just get the sneak. I, I, I attack oh, with sneak attack. I don't oh, get to roll okay. with advantage. It would make, it, it would make 17 hits. Movie. Okay. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Oh, the sixes. What you get? 25, baby. Boom! The ghost is gone. Battered all over you. Does that, does that trigger the librarian out of curiosity? The gunshots don't apparently. No. Oh! No, me, no. Back the fuck up. <laughs> it's time for evil spirit number two. And it's going free big boy once again. Oh, why is everybody picking on the boy? It's the one that's right behind you. 
Good boy. Oh, Grandma says go for Steven. Ooh. Grandma! No. Grandma! Not that one. I, I'm. I'm. It's the turn of the one that's behind Big Boy. So, Big Boy. I don't hit you. Yay! I rolled five. It's your turn, big boy. All right. I'm going to go with my original plan last time, mm -hmm. which was sword birth. Yeah. Sword birth? Oh, birth. my God. That's horrible. Sword okay. birth. So make that dexterity save. Both of them. The one behind you failed. The one in front of you failed. <laughs> Second so what charm, happens now? Right? Back uh, take 1d6 force damage. The uh, spell's you gotta damage. roll that. Yeah, yeah. Well, I got 1d6 for both of them. I'm gonna roll them both at the same time. You're at 5th level, right? Yeah, but not wizard. I'm a level 3 wizard. Wizard, 4th level, fighter, 1st oh. level. Got a three and I got a five. I'm gonna say mm, have the five be the guy behind me. Which one did you roll first? I rolled them at the same time. Oh, Should okay. I rolled one and then the other. All right, no, no, it's okay. Um, yeah, okay. So the one behind you gets five. Because he's fresh. And the one in front of you gets three. Yes. Okay. Is that all you have for this turn, or do you have something else? I have... <laughs> Pardon me. I have... A reaction. I would like to... You're not reacting. Oh, you're right, I'm not reacting. That's it, I'm done. Alright. So, it's time for the other evil spirit. They're both looking at you now. Oh no. Okay, I'm here to help. I just rolled a one. <gasps> Yay! That would have missed so Steve So, that around. spirit... Concentrates so hard it explodes? <laughs> no. Boo. It takes a dump misses you right on Steven's chest. And <laughs> accidentally touches its friend. Oh no! Even better. And it hits them. You're standing right inside of the ghost now. I know. Oh. Oh. Does that mean I'm oh. cold? Does that mean all my fur is cold and gooey now? Stand perfectly yes. still. The arrow won't hurt you. Did you just crit on damage? Because that looked like a DM palm, face palm. <laughs> that silence is very foreboding. It really is. I was 17. That's and let me low. check if the other guy makes his save. He does not. Mm. <laughs> so he loses 17 from his max hit points. Okay. That would be dangerous for Big Boy or basically anyone at this point. It's Die. a sneaky raven's turn. Gonna pop, carefully pop around the corner and shoot that closest one again. How? All right, shoot him. Be careful about the shoot. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, you better be careful. Seventeen. Don't, you, don't yeah. you hit him with a seventeen. And then one d six. Let's see, six damage plus ten, so sixteen all in all. Mr. Stardust says, have fun grooming big boy. <laughs> I am bird, I do not groom. Not, not you. I do not. <laughs> oh. Big boy oh, grooms good. himself. So you did 16 to that one that's in big boy, or around big boy. The premise of big boy, what have you. It's dead. I cautiously back up and hide again. 
Where the fuck you going? Alright. Wait, Beast. what the fuck? Beast, I only rolled a third. I, I only rolled a two. Steven, a are you s still with Beast. us? Come on, let's do this. 19, I have... <laughs> Two successes. Holy two successes. Shit. Holy yeah. shit. <laughs> Why won't you die? <laughs> Steve was supposed to be dead by this point, wasn't he? Long ago. <laughs> Long ago. Does Big Boy get hairballs? Oh yes, Big and, Boy definitely gets hairballs. Um, unless they give him like special hairball medicine. They also say that we're talking about the character Big Boy. Oh, <laughs> that's going. I don't think it's the same. <laughs> that's going. Not to your taste... actual cat named Big Boy. <laughs> and uh, also, Mistress Stardust says that's going to taste so gross. Yeah. Oh, that is going to taste like butthole. Well, teardrop. What are you doing? All right. What you um, doing? She does not want to fire into these people, so she's going to just move to this square here where she's got a clear line of sight. Okay. She's going to... Yes. She's going to move her eye patch to the other eye because she actually <laughs> has both eyes. Just say, all right, okay. And say, maybe I'll hit better with this one. Wait, you have <laughs> both eyes? You're I thought, unconscious. I thought one was damaged. No, pirates wear an eye You're patch unconscious. Eye. You can't it be was, saying that. Oh, I know. This is the player saying this. I remember okay, in, okay. In, in, in the home game, it was that magic thing that she had. She just had to replace it. She still had an eye. Oh, that shit. I forgot all about that fucking thing. <laughs> <laughs> so she just kind of moves the eye patch for a second? All right, Thank you, Raven. Just see something. 14 plus 5, 19. You kill it. Boom. Oh no, I didn't. That's not the damage. That was 19 to hit. I gotta roll damage. Oh, sorry. Roll damage then. Oh yeah, I, I don't want to cheat. I don't want to cheat. It, it's on the verge of death. So. Ten in total. Yeah, that does it. It's dead. Oh really? She looks. At, she looks at the pistols. She looks at them. She looks at the pistol. <laughs> Yeah, right. Raven staring at you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Mister. I mean, hey, Miss. What? You have two eyes too? No. And she just walks up to Steven. Are <laughs> <laughs> you showing no. a mocking emotion? No, Whether you no. can see it or not? <laughs> not at all. Can I make one more death saving throw? Yes, you may. Come on, that one. Steven hey! wow. is no longer with us. Steven Steven. built themselves to die finally. <laughs> Steven, rest, are you alright? Rest in peace, Steven. Where? You hear me give my death rattle off. Leg. <laughs> <laughs> Famous last words. <laughs> I, you know, I want to say I liked him, but in all truthfulness, he was really fucking odd, wasn't he? Blind Observer <laughs> says, oh no, anyway. <laughs> as Steven, le as Steven lets out their little death gasp, you guys hear the, the front door open. I turn around, bow in hand. Actually, oh. my bow has never left my hand. Well, Mr. Stardust more, says, then. give him like five minutes, the gods will spit them back out. <laughs> <laughs> so, no. yeah, you guys hear the doors open. Do we start heading to the doors? Big boy's looking for the key still. I think he Raven goes to the door because he's curious who entered. While this is happening, Dan. Mm-hmm. Kira does want to take a second and lean down to Steven. You are right. Sorry that she died. And just kind of makes sure, like uh, go in and uh, close his eyes, just say, especially in this fucking place. And just <laughs> just kind of like get get up, look around. 
and keep on doing the thing and just like, all right, where the fuck are we going? <laughs> just to get, so, uh, funny meta so knowledge. So, Sneaky Raven is, okay, go ahead. It's funny knowledge, uh, meta knowledge. Steven dies a lot, but somehow gets resurrected a lot in my other campaigns. Like, this is, this is a normal thing for Steven. A normal day in the life of Steven. Yep. So, just a regular Tuesday. <laughs> Sneaky bird, man. As you're getting towards the entrance, you see someone walks through the doors, and then they turn back, and they grab the door handle, and they close it. Wait. Oh, wait, I'm not there. Wait, what the am I doing? Handle. It's here in her what do you mean by oh. door handle? The, the yeah, handle that's on the floor? The side drawer? And the staircase in the floor. Okay, so that. What? Door. What I side door? Way. What are you talking about? The entrance. The door that was locked. That's why I was just double checking. So, okay. Emily, please introduce us to our new friend. So, this new friend is well acquainted with Stephen and uh, Elizabeth Teardrop. She is an air genasi, and her name is Erin. She is followed in teardrops, Ooh. footsteps, and become a dread pirate. She's so, in her twenties. The king now. had also had also called for her, but she was running a bit late. <laughs> Do I we? Duck. Hello. I duck around the corner and hide. When okay. you say hello. I don't even know where I left the ghost at this point. <laughs> Before she gets silenced, can I roll a perception to see if I hear it? You hear it. So you see a ghostly figure up here. Oh. This is not my For character For some reason, shit. they won't stop hovering, so... <laughs> so the game has glitched and this ghost is now floating way higher than it's supposed to. Okay, um, just, okay. just go with, go with it. Um, <laughs> he just goes <laughs> and silence oh. is casted. I, I just bow my head the library. and like as an apology. She just whispered Silence in the library. Okay. I don't hear okay come out, and I'm like, <gasps> I All right. Uh, what was that, Grim? I said, I was actually saying hello very loud, and I made the duck for cover behind a bookcase, or the closest bit of cover, just in case. Okay, you're alerted. behind the bookcase. I'm not moving. I'm um, back in the observ observatory room, uh, what are you guys doing? Big Boy's looking for secret slash the key. While Big Boy's looking for the key, I would like, Tear's gonna go and put her good eye to the, to the, to the, telescope? to the telescope. Okay. Move Teardrop in there. Oh no. <laughs> I do I don't, I don't like that at all. Uh, and you know what? And I, I just don't see her looking for traps or anything. She's just not. She's gonna be. Like... When when you peek through, you see something huge. Something way bigger than it's supposed to be. You see a key. That's what you see. Can she investigate to see if the key's like on this fucking thing? Like if it's like on the lens or something? It it looks like it's inside of the telescope. Now when you check around you do see there's like a little side panel you could open. Slide me this telescope. I'm slide a hand it better said. You don't have to. It has like a little handle. There it is inside the key. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> she, she just goes to taste the key. Hey, big boy. 
tell me some secrets. Are we still quiet? No. So. Yes, you are still quiet. You, you don't get to say that to big boy. <laughs> she, she's gonna just, um... How, how big is big boy, by the way? How tall is he? Uh, I mean, same height as the average bear, I guess. I mean, not an actual oh bear. Oh my god. <laughs> not an actual bear. <laughs> um, but, I was, yeah. I was just wondering if, if she would be taller. So, um, no, she'll just kind of go past your shoulder and just kind of, like, move the key around, like... Big boy's eyes dilate, and he just kind of, like, bats at it. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> and uh, Tia, Tia will go and hold it, and then she, uh, she'll, she'll tap them on, on the shoulder and just kind of tap to her hand. And kind of do, like, the whole hand signal you know, of, get, let's get the fuck out of this room. So, going back to the entrance, um, what is your character doing, Em? Um, I'm gonna... What was your name again? It was uh, Aaron? Yes. I'm going to walk up right to this reception table. Cause... That's and where... you see the note right there. All late returns must be made at the back office. Um, am I able to see a back office, like whereabouts it would be, or is it too far to see? It's too far to see. There's an entire room in the way. Okay. I'm so you wouldn't see that door. Gonna walk down this carpeted pathway. As you're walking down, um, do me a perception check. Perception. I'm actually get skills now. <laughs> Never. Let's see what I get. Oh, nope, I don't. I got six. Okay, you don't see anything. Keep going. Do we see them now? But, but you, um, Sneaky, you see them walk right by you. Just pop. Okay, I just carefully shadow her. Or him. Or, I carefully shadow the Genasi. Uh, okay. From I, a distance. I look to the left and look to the right where the carpet leads off. Do I see any back office? You see a door to the right. Oh, perfect. Yeah. I head to I the door. To I whisper to myself real quick. Do I hear anything at the moment when I talk to myself? You do. Your voices are back. I just casually walk up and say, I'm not being quiet, just subtle enough for I say, Hey there, friend. We're getting the key for that door. Um. Please don't stab me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sneaky. I'm sneaky, Raven. Hi. <laughs> Blind observer. <laughs> Blind observer says, "Why is it still three rogues and a caster?" <laughs> <laughs> a better rogue, though. Nothing. Nothing's changed. Nothing has changed. Um, is is this person a rogue? Yes. Yeah. I just say. Oh, okay. Let's see what was it? And Miss Elizabeth. With other, which was the kitty cat getting getting the key when I saw you. You're friends with so uh, teardrop Elizabeth and kitty cat. What are you guys doing? Oh, yes. Uh, if we're back, if we're back in the hallway, do we see them down down by the door? You do. You see them. I guess Elizabeth we're headed that direction. Boy. All right. So to making our way downtown, moving fast. Walking fast, faces as fast. As soon as I down. see teardrop, teardrop! I say, we, oh I my say, gosh! Don't make loud, I just say, don't make loud noises. Oh, like, I'm, so I'm not quiet. shouting. I'm not you, shouting. You? Are you sure you're not shouting? That kind of sounded pretty loud. Yeah, as you're being loud, sneaky mm, raven. Sneaky. Let me roll a one d twenty. Even I am odd. I am not. I am. Even... Oh, wait, no. One is an odd number. Yeah. My bad. Ten is even. It was close to even. Right. It was right next to even. Mm -hmm. Even adjacent. Steven truly was a Bioware, Bioware tutorial character. His real character replacement is the same class and everything, <laughs> says okay. Blind Observer. Teardrop yeah. will look at, we'll look at Aaron. Brand Do I know w. you? Um, I look at you. And Speak I 
would like to gust a pillow of wind towards you. You've been Febrezed. <laughs> Teardrop will walk up to you. Pirate's Code. Pirate's Code. I, think the I hug end. you. I don't shake it's your hand. Fucking, What's a pirate's fucking come here, kid. Look at you, holy shit, you're fucking going into a whole goddamn pirate. I'll be damned. If I was, if I didn't do any fucking thing right, I fucking at least did this. She's kind of taps you on the back. Good to see you, kid. Good to be here. I'm older now. Got gray in my hair. Uglier, too. Got my eye back. And she just goes and puts the uh, patch down. loudly. <laughs> <laughs> I saw both. I saw Come both eyes. But you're a little bit late to the party. It seems that we were dealing with some type of eldritch horror by the name of Stephen that refused to die. But that's a whole different story that we'll have to go and deal with. Steven. Stephen's alive. Oh. A whole different. We'll talk about that when we're done. Because I've got we got a key. And here we'll just say the Stephen's door. alive. No. Well, see, well, Stephen. <laughs> well, sort of. Stephen. Stephen's alive. dead, but he was alive. Oh. But Again? then he died. Again. It's, it's a long story. Again. But he just walks into the door. <laughs> she turns the key. All right. Does it so the no, the door opens and give me a moment. You see a room. A room where the 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 roof caved in. And you see a pile of papers, and they are leading to a box that is on a table. Who's got the Suddenly, the the spirit appears. Kitty has, Kitty has the book. And she says, "Seems like, despite my best efforts, you still made it here." Oh well, that's okay. I will simply call. For the aid of my assistant librarian. Oh, Mrs. Miss Bones. You see that she disappears. And suddenly, what does appear? I really. Holy shit! What is that? That is Miss Bones. Is that the assistant Bones? librarian. Beautiful. That is a large undead hill giant. Oh. Oh fuck. This is why I fucking hate the library. Are we roll initiative? <laughs> God. Yes. Oh, I don't have any more dread points either. Fuck. All right, a full twenty. So I rolled twenty-five this time. I wasted that on initiative. Could have been an attack. Nineteen. Seventeen plus three, dirty twenty, baby. Seven. As young as you are, you're still slower. Shut up. <laughs> Okay. Let's uh, set up that order. Oh boy. I'm actually very afraid to get punched by the assistant librarian. Is it bad <laughs> that I'm kind of turned on, like scare roused? Oh. <laughs> oh. Scare roused. I mean, look at her. So, I mean, first pretty... is Grim. Then it's. Daniel. Tear, you fucker. Tear. Then, oh, I'm I'm sorry. Tear. Excuse me. Sneaky Raven. See now now I lost track. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <laughs> Grandma says Kenkus don't talk. They mimic. Oh, this is a special a special Kenku. Ken. Ugh. It's a special bird. No, I Can't even say its name. 
Okay, so I got you, you, you. Then it's the monster. And then... It's the new friend. Oh. And friend. we start with the bird. The bird is a word. I will. Since I will Did you say you ain't moving? No. I was thinking, I, I don't me, I wasn't sneaking at the moment, so I would need to bonus act and sneak to get my sneak off. Sneak attack off, since it, it can't see me currently, correct? No, you are not at the doorway. Didn't it take some? <laughs> Rolled 18 for stealth. And by the way, the roof is missing in this room, so that's why this giant fits there. Wait, can I see it over the wall then? No, you cannot. Okay. The roof is still intact in the hallway that you're in. Fair enough. I'll carefully sneak up to the right just enough so I can see it and pop my shot. All right, you see it. Pop that shot. Twenty-five. Of... Twenty-five hits. Nine, and then of. Uh, Twenty. All in all. Twenty. You. You're not getting sneak attack from this one, are you? I stealth the I stealth ahead of time. Bonus action. That's where I rolled the eighteen for. Oh, okay, okay. Well, if that didn't work, then I won't count the sneak attack. You just didn't, never said it did, so I presumed it did. I'm gonna say it works, and you said twenty five, right? No, okay. just twenty. Just twenty. Okay. Yeah. All right, you hit it. Oh. oh. Back up five feet so it can sneak next turn if necessary. Teardrop, it's your turn. She's gonna turn to Big Boy. Big Boy, I've got an idea. Hand me the book. Big Boy hands her the book. Okay. DM, I'm gonna put myself in a little bit of. I'm gonna put myself into some danger. Oh? What you gonna do, friend? She's just gonna go and turn to Aaron and be like, well, just in case, make sure that if I do die here, that you take my fucking body out of this place. <laughs> and she is going to beeline, dash, move 60 feet. How many tiles is that? Uh... Oh, if it's 60, if every feet's 12, I'm 5. Okay, that's so about actually... 9 tiles. So she's actually gonna be able to make it right up to the box? Like, and she's just gonna. I can't do shit else. But she's gonna go and take the book, look up at the giant, and be like, shit. Because I can't item interaction, can I? After that shit. Oh, you already... Y you already item interactioned by you, getting you, the book. You are, the, you are correct. You, Yep, 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 you are correct. So she's just going to go and have the book, and she's just like... Okay, hopefully this works. <laughs> and she's not going to do shit else. And she's just going to prepare herself like, Well, life has been good. I've, I've lived a good one. <laughs> she, she's just going to wait. That's her turn. All right. Big boy, your turn. Big boy is going to cast reduce on this assistant. Nice. So first he's going to get a little bit like in the door. Mm -hmm. Even though he's already in range. He's more in That's range uh, now. Uh, cast reduce. Which, do you want me to read? Please, share, share with us what does Reduce do. The target size is halved in all dimensions, and its weight is reduced to one-eighth of normal. This reduction decreases its size by one category form from medium to small, for example. Until the spell ends, the target is also has disadvantage on strength checks and strike saving throws. 
target's weapon also shrinks to match its new size. While these weapons are reduced, the target's attacks with them deal 1d4 less damage. This can't reduce the damage below 1. Okay. Constitution saving throw. For battling a giant. Come on, make it make it a regular medium-sized creature. Here I go, I'm rolling. Here we go. Wait, no, you don't. You don't roll. They roll. They roll a Constitution oh. uh, saving throw. Roll a Constitution saving much? throw already. Of what? Uh, fourteen. I got a six. Yay! Yay! It's a lot smaller. Oof. That base, that it's base, big. that base got a lot bigger though. Yeah. <laughs> um, I turned off the fly because. Oh, okay. I don't know if it if it is in your screen, but in my screen, it's just hovering off the ground for some reason. Yeah. Oh, uh, the base? This game is in early access, so... It's all good, and we're beating the crap out of it. It's alright. Alright. So, big boy, is that the end of your turn? <laughs> um... Hold on, I want to check my bonus action. Mm... Yes, that's the end of my turn. I was useful enough. It... Okay, Blind Observer, this is Tailspire. It's on Early Access and Steam. So it's Miss Bones' turn. And Miss Bones is not very happy with the person trying to do the late return. Oh boy. Oh boy is right. Let's see. Don't forget that the attack deals 1d4 less damage than normal. <laughs> so, a bright streak flashes from the fingers of of this of Miss Bones. Oh no. It's a fireball. Oh shit, I might be able to do something. What was that? I might be able to do something. No, no, no. I can't be closer. Well you need to make a dexterity saving throw. Me? I do have uncanny dodge. When a turkey you can, when you can see hits you with an attack, you can use it. Or is it the other one that is it evasion that I need to have for spells? Because my brain has ceased to work. Un uncanny dodge is if you can see it, you, this reaction, you can half that damage. Okay, so do you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna go and roll because I got a plus six, baby. I'm for it. I'm for it. Let's do it. <laughs> All it, right. Fifty, 50 plus Make six, that... twenty-one. Suck my genosi asia, fucker. Oh. Okay. Okay. Can, since I made it, can I use my body to cover the book so it doesn't burn it? You can. You're still going to take half damage. So. Yeah, that's that's. Fine. Don't forget. Bear with it's me. Less. Because I need more die. See? Oh no. Want to borrow some of mine? I got spares. Ooh, no, I got ooh. I got plenty. Oh no. One, two. Oh no. Three. <laughs> Come on. Where, where are my, my dice at? I Four. Is that all you got, you big five piece of cow shit. Six. <laughs> um, I still need some more. Seven. I made a calculated risk, everyone. 
Uh, Eight. And I am not good at math. Uh, Sneaky Raven might have been too. Oh, you hear that? Oh, lots of clickety clacketing. <laughs> so. Oh, this. Daniel, this is a lot. I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait. Okay. After the game, I will post the, uh, the monster sheet that I gave. You take half of 25. Fuck. Fuck! I'm still, I'm That's still, still a lot! Don't I'm forget still, I'm minus 1d4. Is that for spells, or is that just no, for it, weapons? When it, when, it, when, it, when it work on spells, it's just for physical attacks. I oh. take 13 points of damage to the fucking chin, baby. Take 13, yep. Oh, fuck me. That could have been, been a lot worse. That could have been but a lot, can lot I, worse. Can I use my interception to reduce the damage? No, because that's for physical attacks, if I'm not mistaken. Once she gets blown up like that, she's kind of like I'm hiding into this. Anyway. Let me know. So, let me, know. So let, me let me just add something for, for a little flair. Give, give me a second. Uh, where are my lights category? That's a lot of fire. You're alive. Mm. Oh, she's I'm alive. I'm fucking alive. God damn. I am. So, it's your turn. Before her turn ends, I have a reaction. I'm going to spend okay. a dread point, and when a creature within 30 feet of you takes an action, you can spend one dread point as a reaction in order to make a single melee or ranged attack against uh, that creature. On a successful hit, the target must succeed on a constitution saving throw. So or... walk the plank? Yes. Uh, no, belay that. Um throw or lose their action for the remainder of the round. The attack only gazes at the target and does not cause damage. So, I... So you're, so you're I, telling me you can stop that? I can't stop it. I have to wait till an action is made. They made their action. Okay. That was their yes. action. I'm going to prevent them from doing any legendary actions or reactions or anything bonus action or anything like that. Okay. But I can't stop what they just did because they needed to make an action for me to trigger it. So, okay. I'm going to throw my dagger at them. Throw away. Uh, that's a plus right. six. That's a dirty 20. Ooh. You got it. And now the damage for it. That way it doesn't do no any damage. damage. That's right. So it just... Uh, yeah. No reactions or any other fun stuff. Yep. Now it's your proper turn. Excellent. And I just lost the dagger. Um, so I am going to take my movement of 5, 10, 15, 20, and a half right there. Half. Um, and then I am going to be using, uh, what is it, a bonus... Where is it? It's a feature or trait where I can fly. Captain's orders. Mingle with the wind. You cast a uh, levitate without material components once per long rest. Khan is your special uh, spellcasting ability. Um, so I'm going to levitate and I would... me make you fly. Hey, Crockett's watching Ooh. apparently. Hey, oh, I want to go. Crock's rocket. Yeah, I want to get to f almost space level with them. Um, so that was a casting a spell uh, that it counts as a bonus action. So I am going to be doing uh, in my main attack action as Psychic Shock. Um, let's see if it hits. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Why won't you roll in D&D being... Uh, let me refresh my page real fast. There we go. Psychic Shark. 
Let's go. Open tail spider. Uh, da, da, da. Uh, that is a 12. Mm. That 12 is not going to do it. <laughs> and now I'm perfectly level with it. Uh, I'd use my bonus action. <laughs> Shit. I am <laughs> going to just be levitating right there. Perfect yeah. swinging Weapons. height. Swatting distance. Cool. Shit! Sneaky Raven, it's your turn. Um. I guess I'll pop around the corner and shoot at, shoot at them again. Okay, yep. try not to hit your new friend. Since I'm sneaky. Alright, a night, nat 20. Nice. Nice. So, so do you dedicate that nap 20 to? Crockett, of course. Our, a DM and a, our DM and another DM. Yeah. <laughs> well, 14 from that, and then, of course, sneak attack. Fourteen, so 28 all in all. 28, oof. And then I pop around back around the corner and sneak in. Okay. That is my purpose. You <laughs> you see that, that the giant is kind of reeling back from that, that hit? <laughs> Teardrop, it's your turn. <laughs> the monster is distracted. There are flames all around you. Teardrop looks around. Do look towards Aaron. She smiles. And she'll actually, she'll whisper, here's your fucking book. And she puts it in a box and she closes the lid. <laughs> when you close that lid, you see fires one by one start to, whoops, I accidentally <laughs> took the table. The fires start disappearing. And the uh, assistant librarian tumbles over and crumbles into dust. Miss Bones. Lastly, the ghost of the librarian appears and she says, Thank you for returning the book. Please come again. We are always adding new books to our collection. Mm. And she disappears one last time. Dang. Congratulations, guys. You have successfully returned the book to the library. Yay! I think it hit a single toe. I think that's the first Only time one honestly. casualty. Oh, oh and that was so it's beautiful. It's funny that you should say that. One casualty? Since you guys are currently in a room with no, no roof, uh -oh. the heavens, they open up. Yeah, stay stay oh. focused on the room that you guys are in. And and like a light, a beam of light from, from the heavens comes down onto this room. And, and you see down. something. You, you see something falling. Oh my god, it's Steven! <laughs> <laughs> the gods spit him it's, out! It's Steven. He just fell from the sky. Oh! And, and he sits up. And he's like, he looks around. What I miss? <laughs> Oh my god, by Stephen Lynch. Oh. Elizabeth, I've been meaning to tell you. I love you. This is Stephen talking, right? Yes. Well, Elizabeth, Elizabeth goes to go and unhitch the gun. Hey. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> she, just, she, just, she just holds it again. That sounds like a you problem. 
we're gonna have to deal with that. <laughs> and with that, we close this chapter, this one-shot adventure of Legion. Yay! Thank you so much. I really thank enjoyed it. This was amazing. Thank you, every thank you, players. This has been lots of fun. Thank you to everyone that's been watching the the stream. Yes. You you your guys and your comments have been fantastic. I am so happy we all could share all these moments together. That this game was a wild ride. That was a lot yes. of fun. That was a lot of fun. Use the die. <laughs> and uh, and and uh, and we will we will be back to our normally uh, planned escapades hopefully very soon. Yes. And as and as your Legion DM, I want to go and say thank you to everyone. I don't get a chance to play very often. Thank you, Miguel. That was a lot of fun. Yes. And it it was thank very enjoyable. Yes. Thank you for for being such great players. I loved GMing you guys. This this was fantastic. Like ten out of ten. I this was I, fun. I have missed teardrop so much. It's been so, so much fun. So be sure to join our Discord guys. That is the best way to support us. In our Discord Most definitely. Yes. In our Discord I will be posting it with um Miss Bones, the assistant librarian, into the one offs channel so you can see how all the stuff that she could have done before Teardrop she, solved it. I You have solved my library riddle. <laughs> <laughs> um be sure to check us out. Uh we Mondays we have Mondays, Wednesdays and uh sometimes Sundays we have Maha Mondays at eight thirty Eastern. Uh Tuesdays Matt Making with Emily at three forty five PM uh, Thursdays are normally scheduled Legion at 7.30 p.m. Fridays, uh, we do Watch Us Die more times than not around 8 p.m. Eastern. Uh, Saturdays, a sip of, uh, sorry, not uh, Matanzo Speaks and the B-List, the floating schedule that's been Matan that Francisco runs for B-rated games and voice acting. And this Sunday, uh, a sip of Zanar, oh, uh, Something Wicked This Way Comes, where we go over, oh, I'll actually let you talk about it, Daniel. So everyone come and prick your thumbs for something wicked this way comes. This weekend, this Sunday, we will be talking about cryptids as I continue to work on the royal family, which has become a monster, a bear of a task, but it's it's really forming into a really good one. I had some time to go and talk about some of the uh, funner cryptids. We're going to be talking about the Jersey Devil, the Mothman, Bigfoot, and uh, Nessie because I wanted something that reminded me of my childhood and just to go and share with all of you the very first book that I ever read on my own as a child was about the Loch Ness Monster and it put a fascination of cryptid creatures in my mind so we'll talk about scientific discoveries and debunking a lot of stuff so just kind of throwing it out there if you think that I'm going to come with stuff that's going to make you believe Maybe not. But anyways, <laughs> just wanted to go and let you know. Yep. So that this is weekend, two p.m. Correct. That is two p.m. And before that, um, M and I have been talking. Um, I I want to do something a little bit different with all of you. Um, and we're gonna do a little bit of a of a palate cleanser before we go we do all that. And we are gonna be playing some Power Wash Simulator. And we're just gonna talk. I want to invite you guys to come in at 1.30. It's just going to be for 30 minutes. And I want you to have a moment to just sit with me and go and power wash some things. And I want you to go and share stories with me. I want you to go and tell me how you're feeling that morning. I want you to go and tell me how you're weak. And, how you're weak. and we'll kind of get into that headspace so that we can be calm and relaxed. And then we're going to go talk about some really gnarly shit. So I'm really, really excited to go give it a try and... Yeah, so I will see you all on Sunday. Also, and, uh, also coming soon, A Sip of Sonaris, where Daniel will be reading yes. the abridged version of Moby Dick. He's narrowed it down to 300 pages, so you don't have to listen oh, to 800 God. plus pages of that. Um, There's so much. There's just so much. But, uh, but yes, I'm super excited. We've got a lot of things that we've actually effectively got really worked on now, and 
Uh, and also just kind of wanting to go and say thank you to everybody who's reached out and continue to reach out. Um, as some of you don't know and some of you don't, my mom passed away uh, a few weeks back. And uh, forgive me, I've, I've been kind of in a little bit of a of a, of a loop-de-loop, but um, finally starting to feel a lot more like myself and been able to kind of concentrate back on the fun things and being able to do fun stuff like that. And I couldn't do that without all of you. For that, I'm very, very thankful. I'm very, very thankful to have you all watching us and enjoying the silly, silly shit that we do. But yeah, just wanted to go and say that. Also, a couple other things to touch on. Uh, this coming soon to the end of August, I believe is when we'll be starting. We'll be starting a new tabletop RPG, Vampire the Masquerade. Uh, mm -hmm. It will be starring a few of our players that you know. Um, we have Grim, uh, Miguel, Daniel, and then also Leo and Melanie. Harley is going to be sitting this one out, but she has designed a lot of our NPCs from the Fey world that you'll be seeing. Um, and then also coming soon, we're not sure when, but Miguel is going to be dipping his toes into the water and going to be broadcasting. Uh, yeah. Uh, so be sure to keep an eye out for that. Do you want to talk to on that at all, Miguel? I'm putting you on the spot. Oh, oh no! <laughs> I've been in the I've been in the spot this whole stream. Born. Yeah, spot. I'm. No, just despite. going to. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> I'm just going to be streaming more video games. Um, I don't know when or where in the schedule I'm going to be fitting in, but you'll find a little nook and cranny for me. But. I'm not going to be using this ugly old mug. I'm going to be a VTuber. Woo! So, fun like times that with mug. that. I like that you mug. Young kids are doing. You better like that mug. You married it. All, all, of, all of these young people with their animes and their, and their wee boo and their hentai. I'm going to be super kawaii. Oh, I like your old, old man. <laughs> so sugoi. Sugoi. <laughs> Ooh, ooh. Oh, oh, oh. Well, Miguel. Ooh, ooh. Ooh. Well, Miguel, take us out. I, I don't have any weapons. <laughs> say goodnight. Oh, you mean say goodnight? Oh, okay. Or kill us. Well, that was your first option. That's very worse. I'll say goodnight first. It's okay. Part good part night, part. everybody. Good night. Bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye. Just go and know the. Just roll a twenty six. <laughs> no. A twenty five. Oh, close. Jesus Christ. Did you actually roll a twenty? On a a twenty five. <laughs> because chaos has now it's begun adorable. to rain. <laughs>